Hello, welcome to Champions of Salt Season 1, Week 2, powered by Good Shepherd Entertainment. We have invited six amazing streamers to compete every Tuesday for four weeks. Last week, Michael L. Fox was eliminated, and we have two opening videos for you guys. First, we'll have... The opening video, very similar style from last week. And then we'll also introduce you to a new format, which is previously on. So please enjoy the video. Victory! You managed to complete the course! Just uh, run your sets, uh, don't get, get too, uh, too in there. Ow, ow. We got him! We did it! Let's Yo. go! Yes. I just destroyed it all What the shit. hell? How the fuck did you do that? Yeah. With the, with the boom. Oh! Welcome to Champions of Salt Season 1, powered by Good Shepherd Entertainment. Victory! You managed to complete the course! Four, one, two, one, 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 one. You didn't win. Go back to Kingston. You will not win. Go back, <laughs> back, Sun Sun. Be right. honest, are you, are you using a, a 144 hertz monitor? Uh, I can, I don't know what kind of monitor I have. That concludes, uh, the first part of the competition. Team Northern Lion actually wins this first segment, now gets to have the chance to pick the player be before Team Daniel here. When you're making your first pick in a competition like this, you got to balance axis A and axis B. And that's why I'm going to choose... Mr. Overall, Bear Taffy. It's tough. You know, you, you got Rob. Rob's an all-around ball player. You know, he's going to boost morale. He's going to be a great teammate. Um, uh, excuse me. Uh, Mrs. Letourneau, I thought I had the floor. Can, can you... Uh, it was someone chewing into the lavalier. <laughs> you know, uh, in particular, the camp over at Letourneau, Inc. Have them lowly graded. Ladies and gentlemen, my first pick. Michael A.L. Fox. Halo 2 came out. And even though I never played it with either of the individuals, I think that that's a dang, bond that crosses dang, front dang zip <laughs> Daniel, please refrain from making any further noise, please. <laughs> by surviving and then watching, making it to one of the exits chat. on the map. Is there a, uh, I'm sorry, did the wires get crossed? Is the audio, you know, audio guy, Kate, I'll take it. <laughs> audio guy, you're fired. All right, you know, this is a high production. Good Shepherd sponsored it. We've got multiple cameras. Look, go work on Ryan's show. He needs an audio guy. He's not here, though. With my second pick, I select... <laughs> 
smart dog. With my last pick, he's the glue that keeps the team together. They may call him the last pick on the draft board, but he's the first pick in our heart. I never right? said that. Robert L. Pack, a patrol. So the next game we'll be playing is going to be Black Future 88. We did it! Let's they go. beat the game! Let's go! Team Northern Lion actually has beaten the game. Minkus! You're so Daniel, good, don't man. give up! You got this! Oh, one oh, HP left, Daniel! Oh. One HP! Oh. Rob, I'll tell you what, end of the day. Easy yeah. clap. Can we like have win, easy clap what, we gave the people for Daniel, show. please? I agree, dude. Now, I have the result. It was a very close result. Mm -hmm. Three and two. Oof. Three people voted. Michael L. Fox. Could be a good time. Uh, it will be a good time. You and I. You and I, it's gonna be a good time. Yeah, yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Michael Ale Fox. Hello. I was wondering when uh, I would get to. Hello. Hi. How's it going, Kate? <laughs> we made a special video for you to give a special introduction for our special first jury in the house. Thank you. Is it like one of those GTA style videos where I get wasted? <laughs> <laughs> no, that was last week. This oh, week you okay. get to revenge. Yes. Well, that's my plan. I'm I'm very much ready to revenge. And I was telling peeps on my end, you're probably going to uh, share the agenda, and that'll let them know how I get to exact my revenge. Because I exactly. will. Exactly. Exactly. So we're gonna run through the timetable real quick. In two minutes, we're going to start with the Crypt of Necodancer. It's going to be in the hard mode. Uh, people, everybody will be competing solo. No, no co-op is solo play. And it, they have two hours for to reach the highest score. We're not looking for a quick time. It's high score. Most gold equals highest score. So there's that. And then we'll have three minute break and then we'll come to the human fall flat and that's where michael l fox will join in and either he could help out or he might not it's it's up to him <laughs> <laughs> and then we'll vote we'll take another five minute break during break uh players are free to talk to each other uh, it's it's uh you know there's no restriction on that and uh after five minutes we'll res uh give you the result of the vote and that will conclude tonight's event but to start let's have everybody i'll i'll drag us to the general section here to say hello to everybody oh, oh hello hey. oh hello hello hello, uh, hello. hello. <laughs> <laughs> How are you guys doing tonight? Oh, well, pretty good, pretty Couldn't good. Couldn't be better. Uh, have you guys practiced Crypt of Necrodancer or have you guys oh. ever played Crypt of Necrodancer before? I oh, had yeah. played the new one, mm. but I had not played the old one, so I played a little bit before the stream today. Oh, how about you, Daniel? Yeah. You know what? I was born with Necrodancer built into my synapses. <laughs> not not no, on the hard currently. drive, though. Nope. That, yeah. That's a no. <laughs> Cur <laughs> currently installing the game, yeah. <laughs> I, got, I got it up. I, it's installed. I got the little link character. I'm looking at him. How about, how about you, Rob? Uh, I did not play any of it until the tournament, uh, but I played like nine hours last night while my internet was down. Hey. What? <laughs> You yeah. played nine hours last night? Yeah, dude. Like, you don't, when you don't have internet, man, there's just, there's nothing. There's nothing <laughs> in the on. world. It's the I'm worst. I'm going to Steam. <laughs> oh my God. He has played a lot. Yeah. <laughs> did that last night. Yeah. Yeah, that's we verifiable might, information, isn't it? We might need to change the 3% gate. <laughs> <laughs> that's oh, true. Oh, that's no, true. We did, we did say 
uh, 3% mm -hmm. that Daniel, Team Daniel will win, but we'll see. How about, yeah. how about Bear, though? He, he has quite some time under his belt. You, you can take it down to 2% because I'm going to win. <laughs> oh. you, you, oh. I'm going to be honest. You can take it down to 0%. This is a <laughs> foregone conclusion. Come on now. <laughs> Robert, you know, Robert, when we dialed in a little Synthwave 88, Black Future 88, oh, yeah. and like you showed a lot of fight in you, Robert, and, and that's what we're counting on today. Y'all oh, did honestly you had me scared in that last run you guys did for Black Future. You were You were feeling it. Yeah, I had the power going, man. It was surging. Hey, Bear could have a bad day. He's he's all used to Halo right now. He's not mm. he's not tuned to Necro Dancer. Yeah, yeah. It does have no. my competitive juices firing on all synapses though, so that's <laughs> that is that's true. It could, it could be a double edged sword. I'm ready to kill you guys. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> all right. Well, is everyone ready? I am yeah, at yeah. the yeah. all zones mode select screen. All right. I'm gonna move Mike into the jury room. So just yeah, yeah. wait there for one second. All right, and I'm going to change the overlay here. We have currently Robert uh, on the stream. So if you can have, oh, it's, there you go. If you could change yeah. to the Necro Dancer, that would be great. Sure, yeah. You, you want to? You guys want to see what this looks like from my perspective? Uh, it's, it's, it's a little, it's a little minkus. <laughs> Rob's having some internet issues, but you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, uh, it's snowed, so uh, that means all the internet's down. It's, uh, it think feels, being in it New feels York, like they, they did snow on your stream uh, for sure. You'd think a multi-billion dollar corporation would have some sort of contingency for something so <laughs> common as, you know, snow. <laughs> Uh, Daniel, it seems like your stream is not online. Mm, I'm here. You might want to give it ye, ye old F5. Mm -hmm. Twitch has been doing some, like, I had my stream open and it never started until I refreshed it. Dunk, get the dunk, get the dunk, get the dunk, get the dunk. Okay. No, <laughs> I, I never knew the slap so hard. Oh, yeah. Okay, Daniel's ready. All right, I will move you guys to the team section. All, All right. right. Sounds good. Good luck, boys. Yeah. Good luck. And now... Anything about that. All right. So, it seems like almost everyone's ready. I think... Yeah, I think Dan is ready. Yeah, Ryan's ready. All right. All right. So, I'll tell everybody uh, it's, everyone's good to go, and then they can start. I'll be right back. Okay. Yeah. What are right. your strengths? Oh, yeah. Oh, sorry, to, sorry to inter uh, interrupt. No, uh, no. Anytime, Mrs. Letourneau. You guys <laughs> uh, count to three, and then you guys are ready to go? Yeah. All right. All right. Entertainment. Uh, Thanks sorry to that. interrupt, but you guys, oh. please start. Yeah. We've started. Done deal. All right. Let's go. Let's go. Bottom left, and that's not going. All right. So I, I gave him a green light. Everyone's doing their best. Let's see how. Let's just see how Daniel oh, no, is doing. Squad. I'll, I'll, I'll invite you, but um. Okay. Uh, do we have to do anything uh, to put it in all zone let's, mode? Let's, let's uh. I got. No, I got all the just, perspectives just here. Okay. That, uh, and then how do I? How do I hit spacebar? Daniel. Daniel haven't played tutorial, so I'm just gonna. Oops. No, you just move. I'm just gonna room. move on to. And. Also, Ryan is actually course, Ryan I, killed the first boss. Uh, the makers of well, the so Ryan Dancer, has some hours mm -hmm. in this game, right? Which uh, if yes. I had my thing up, I'd be able to brace tell yourself, you. Games, how, brace how yourself, games. Brace yourself, games. Brace yourself. He's got to be in the double digit territory, right? Two commands. Uh, definitely line. double digit mm -hmm. for sure. I combined it into one. That's this is a, this is immediate links. evidence of the fact okay. that this game is going so to break our brain. In a moment, so when you're ready, oh, I am. I, this is actually. I'm going to start asking you questions <laughs> about so the game. Yeah. Done. Yes, please. Oh, no. Okay. Because some of you out of there, there may there. not know, I've never played Crypt and the Necro Dancer, despite being told it is uh, yeah. a game I would probably rhythm. enjoy quite a bit. So I need. Kate, that to give me a lowdown on the basics of what we're looking at here. They're, they're, I know they're dancing around, but right? There's I like a grid system, and there's enemies. <laughs> I think it's just like That's all oh. I got. Yes. Well, uh, before I explain, I think well, no, Ryan and oh, really? Daniel yeah, might yeah. not be in yeah. the correct mode. Okay. So let me go okay. yell at Get them. Get that sorted out. 
That's yeah, fine. Yeah, sorry about that. I'll, I'll be right here. back. Don't worry. No worries. So I can get that earlier. Mm -hmm. uh, sorry to interrupt, <laughs> boys. Uh, Ryan, I think you're in oh, the wrong mode. Uh, Ryan, I I, that's correct. I need to mode. beat this mode on zone one in order to unlock the all zones mode. So once I kill the boss, <laughs> I will restart in all zones mode. Okay, I'm assuming that will be the same thing for Daniel. I'll yeah. go ask. I don't know. I don't know what goes on in his head. He, yeah, no, he just he'll have to do that too. Okay, I'll I'll go ask. Sorry to interrupt, boys. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, Daniel, you recognize that you're in the wrong mode, yeah? Yeah, yeah. How do I get to the right mode? So apparently, in order to unlock it, you have to beat the first level. Okay. And then after, and then after that, I do that, what you do you want gotta, me to do? You gotta get into the all zone mode. Okay. Yes. That's that's all. That's all. Okay. All right. And then Kate, this is just scored by uh, getting the most coins. Uh, high score is achieved by multiple things. Uh, first of all, coin is the main source of score. And then at the bottom, if you can see, there is coin multiplier. If you actually do not lose any of your beat and you keep with the beat, then uh, the coin multiplier will go up as high as I believe three. So you want to keep that yeah. multiplier high and then pick up the coin as much as you can so you can achieve the highest score. Got you, Kate. And when you strike an enemy, it keeps them on the beat. You have to strike them on the beat. Uh, uh, you just have to do everything on the beat, basically. Yeah. Got it. Okay. Good luck, boys. Thanks, Kate. Thank you. Sorry about that mouth. They had to unlock, or they had to do the tutorial. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Okay. But as, as I explained to Dan... In order to achieve mm -hmm. the high score, which is the goal of this game currently, um, mm -hmm. you first have to pick up coins and you get coins by defeating boss or monsters Correct. or opening yeah. chests. And uh, the best way to get the most coin is to keep up with your beat. If you lose your rhythm, then you lose your coin multiplier. So oh. uh, if you, I think the maximum multiplier that you can get is three. So okay. let's just, for example, instead of one coin, if you are at the max multiplier, then you will gain three instead. So that's how you can stack up the most coins. Ah. Yeah. Okay. So you, you don't you don't wanna you don't wanna just uh, miss the beat and just kill little creatures. You wanna keep up with the beat. Don't lose your beat, and yep. pick up the co pick up the gold coins. Okay, so this that's why people were saying I'd probably like this game because I have a I've dabbled in the per, percussion. So I, I I'm familiar with keeping a beat. It's yeah. a shame I I, I might have uh, uh been able to give these guys a run for the money. I will do that on my It's yes, nice sir. though. I like I So and you said the now they're not doing custom music, but you said there's like a way to do custom music in this game or how what's how does that work? Childhood memory you guys so for custom game? music, um you just need to go to the option and they actually have a really good built-in system. Party, so let's like it it can just detect yeah, what the BPM people, like beats per minute do. is. Okay. So if you were to let's say um put like slow music then it's gonna be slow so you have to move slow like you will soon hopefully see that the uh every map um every floor i should say all right uh, every zone sorry every zone have different bpm so in the starting area it's the dungeon and it's quite i wouldn't say fast but it's not slow but in the second zone it's like a swamp jungle kind of a style so it's a little bit slower um, mm -hmm. So you like, you don't want to go like super fast it. because obviously really that will put you off of the beat. Oh, the so you want to keep up with the beat, but yeah, at the same time it. execute it's all the things that you need to do, which I is kill the enemies, pick up the like, young, coins, so um, pick up items, etc., etc. Okay. And now, oh yeah, go ahead. I was just gonna say you probably mentioned this, but they're playing on hard on a harder mode, right? That's yeah, correct. So hard mode, it's not way. like it's harder. It's just permadeath mode. They, these, so they cannot oh, just like farm 500 heart and 
you know, uh, just mm -hmm. die multiple times and then come back to it. Once oh, you're dead, nice. you're dead. You have to start from the top, just like Isaac. No, it's not like okay. So another thing I'm looking at here, like I'm watching the the heart at the bottom of each screen, mm -hmm. and sometimes I see some of the lines kind of like stay at the sides of the heart. If if you know what I mean. The line stays at the side of the heart. I really like this. Yeah, it looks like they stack up kind of behind it sometimes. Ah, uh, I think that means like maybe. Is that a combo or something? No, no, no. So I think that just means like maybe they were on time or maybe they were a bit slower. But in order to recognize if you're um, not missing any beat and you're on the multiplier, is by looking at your ground, oh like God. looking at the floor. If the floor is like a disco, you know, it's like, uh, you know, green, purple, having lights, that means you're continuing the combo. But oh, if you lose your combo, those lights will go away. And then it also makes it makes like a sound of like, sure. that means like, oh, you, you lost the combo. Okay. Now the, the different colors oh don't God. really mean anything. Like I'm seeing on bears, he's got some red and green. That's, does that mean he's on a different level, mind. or does it mean a different kind of combo? Oh, you know what? Let, Let me go to bears. Attacks. Looks like he's in a like a, a more green. Like a, I think it's ah, like a so jungle. that's the that's the jungle swamp swamp area for sure. So it looks like he's progressing faster than these other guys right that is correct because bear taffy uh he has i bet he has the most hours in this mm -hmm. game so i believe that bear knows what he's doing <laughs> um, so he's in the second Rob... zone oh never mind sorry sorry um okay so i want to know what you as an experienced necro dancer expert <laughs> i i i because i i need to know what percent you think dan actually has of so just then yes. if it's just then i would say like minus 10 percent. not to be rude but he's still in the tutorial here <laughs> <laughs> and um I also don't know how to he's he's that i think he's gonna get killed right here oh uh, boy so is that like a boss or kind of more like uh that's like the boss not a... that's the floor boss and okay. he is like the easiest boss of all time so... oh, he's got like a harp in between oh he points. died <laughs> oh yeah, it's uh, he needs to kill that tutorial boss in order to move on. So I, I used an item and now there's a little shopkeeper. So like, given the the time that they they have for this, how far would you, I guess, right. maybe using Ryan as a reference? It kind of seems like he's not as good as Bear, but he's not new to the game either. How far would you expect Ryan to make it? Like, I don't know how the levels, how many there are, or like how far you could go, or oh, that was like. Dumb. So there are four, what, what you... four zones, like total total amount of zones, there are four in okay. the vanilla game, like excluding the expansion. Um, and as you progress on, it gets harder and harder and harder. So, I mean, with Ryan, I played this game co-op, and I think we made it all the way to third zone. So I, I feel like... He has chance to probably beat the game tonight if he really tries. Mm -hmm. um, but it's not about beating the game here. We're 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 all about the high score, and we're so high score. Let me just explain a bit more about the high score. There are many, many, many different ways to get high score, and one of which is actually very interesting so as you can see right now bear taffy is in the shop shopkeeper is singing if you're to actually kill manage to kill shopkeeper shopkeeper drops this uh item called crown of gold and what it does is that when you wear it when you equip it every step that you take you lose a coin however when you do pick up a, a gold coin it actually you get a i think multiplication of like maybe four like you get a lot more gold when you pick when you do pick up the coin so if you're playing very offensive uh gameplay you want to you want to kill the shopkeeper and 
you want to have that the, the crown of greed and you want to kill monsters asap because less step you take higher uh your score is going to be because you're losing uh gold per step and uh on top of that it's really tricky when you want to do that because once you kill uh once you kill the shopkeeper there's no more shop there's no more item for you. You, you all you all items all equipments that you'll be getting is just spawned like rng style oh so, so it, wait is there there's only one shopkeeper like in the whole that's correct in the whole game oh it's just like a splunky like when you kill the shopkeeper from splunky like he's yeah, out to aggro. get you and then he doesn't sell any items anymore it's like that so you don't you don't really want to kill him like if you're confident and if you think you can just um, uh, finish the whole game with no equipment, no no other equipment necessary, then you can just you should just kill the shopkeeper from the first floor and then get the crown of greed and then just you know move on with all move on with your life. But if you think like you need a little bit of like equipment spells, etc., then maybe you want to wait until a little bit later and then kill the shopkeeper. That then get the crown of greed but killing a shopkeeper uh you know same with other games it's not easy he's not he's not easy he has many many hp and yeah. it's it's gonna be tricky and uh he's gonna kill you most of the times <laughs> just like splunky he's not he's not a fool just sit in there selling items in the dungeon he's gonna attack you he's gonna kill you so it might be a uh, run ender as well mm -hmm. and on top of that another uh score booster is that when you do go to the shopkeeper or when you do go to the shop you will notice that the wall around it is made of gold so if you were to actually blow it up oh. you will get some extra gold there as well so if you have extra bomb you start with only one bomb but as you progress on you might find some uh bombs along the way and in with that extra bomb you should blow up the the walls around so currently if you look at bear taffy um he is in a secret shop so he got he got teleported into the red circly thing that's a teleporter to a secret shop and there are different uh teleporter type and that was a secret shop for the blood like it's like a deal deals with devil kind of a style from the binding of isaac you trade your maximum hp um or not maximum HP, sorry. I think you trade your HP for an equipment. So if if the secret shopkeeper sells you like really good equipment, but they want your two HP, then you have to give them your two HP, and then and then they will sell you the item. So okay. Oh, that was so close. But there there are different secret shops. Um, there is glass shopkeeper and then the glass shopkeeper actually sells glass weapon glass equipment and glass weapon and glass equipment um for weapon though it's the best weapon however if you do get hit because it's made out of glass it shatters and you uh, lose your weapon so it's your yeah your your glass cannon kind exactly. of exactly i see and then for the equipment it's the same thing even it doesn't matter uh if the durability is you know four or five if it's made out of glass if you get hit it breaks you no longer have any equipment mm -hmm. anymore so there's a lot of different aspects um i'm not too sure if uh daniel know about all this i mean <laughs> he, to be fair to be fair bed. i gave everybody uh a week or so and yeah. they definitely did have enough time to kind of research about it but i think i'm still seeing daniel still dying in the tutorial hopefully he will get out of the tutorial soon yeah i mean you know i don't know how much i'm allowed to talk about um what oh, I think you're Dan's you're very strategy. open to talk about daniel here so i kind of i put it kind of simply that even if dan were good enough to win at any of these games which uh he's not um <laughs> he would throw no matter what i think that is i think he wants to lose that's that's part of his strategy oh, um oh interesting i think i mean i know he wanted to get rid of me because of the potential you know alliance uh ryan and i could have so he's gotta i i, I understand why 
And that's why I think he wanted, no matter what, he would have wanted to throw uh, Black Future 88. And I kind of sort of think the similar thing here. Because no matter what, even if Rob goes on the block, it, it means that Austin or, or Bear are going to go on the block. And then that gives us a chance that he gets rid of one of them because they're both obviously very good at games. Uh, Crypto the Necrodancer Bear's doing pretty well in Black Future. He did very well in. So, you know, Bear might want to slow down a little bit. He's, he's making himself look... Like, uh, he's, he's painting a big target on himself, is my my analysis. Now, I could be wrong. I don't know. But I'm just putting it out there. So I think <laughs> I think Dan's kind of letting them do to the just, talking. Right. To, to make, yeah. But you got to keep in mind, this is not per se Big Brother, where if you're a weak player, you should just let them hang so that you can have an easy victory at the end. You know, it's it's mm -hmm. a little different than that. He should True. keep that in mind. It's not... If you're weak, that doesn't mean you get to float until the final. Correct. Yeah. I mean, who knows? There might be people that uh, kind of want to get rid of Dan sooner rather than later. Not for a, a threat in terms of the game, but you never know when he's going to, you know, hold his own funeral. <laughs> right? So they might literally, want to avoid that literally. altogether. Literally. So yeah. It's it's, so we'll it's very true. So if you look at the dance screen right now, that's the shrine. Um, so if you if you were to trade your uh, HP, you get a blood weapon. So there are different types of weapon here. Blood weapon. It's like um, vampire kind of thing. If you ki if you kill ten uh, enemies, you get to recover half of heart. So if you're if you're kind of a player oh. who is kind of dying a lot, you want to take a chance to get that. <laughs> I'm sorry, Daniel is making me laugh. Um, you want you definitely want the blood weapon, but the catch is that the damage is not so great. So it gives you chance to survive a little bit longer, but the damage wise, it's not the strongest. So now he sees in the uh, shop here, that's, I believe, is the Platinum Sphere. So it has two damage. Uh, the default weapons have one damage, and the Sphere is one of the item or the one of the weapon that actually has distance. So instead of uh, Dagger, where it doesn't give you any distance, you have to kill the enemy that's right in front of you. Dagger actually gives you two tile advantage, so you can kill the enemy that is one tile ahead of you. So it's a lot safer um and right. that's the weapon of my choice i really like spear i really like uh long sword they provide safety at the same time if you can get like the platinum or the diamond uh weapon of it it does huge damage so uh you i would recommend daniel to go for that in order to complete the tutorial here but I think it was on sale for 100 gold, and he's currently at 79. So I guess maybe he's currently perhaps farming gold. So yeah, so Let's I see. see people are, you know, Dan was just going through some dirt with the shovel. So that's, is that like, I mean, you get you get gold for killing monsters. Do you get a lot of gold or other secrets for digging through the dirt or... Um. So if you look at the dirt, there are different types of dirt. Some dirt... Yeah. Like, it, as you can see, there's like a gravel here. That's mm -hmm. hard, uh, I guess, like, mm. soil type. You, you have to uh, use the bomb to I'm Sorry, he just destroy. died to a mimic. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Um, so you have to use the bomb to destroy uh, the hard walls. Um, but if you look at the ground that is not, I guess, like, rocks, maybe it just looks like a brown soil you can just dig that through and then sometimes you will see a little bit of like lights shining from that um uh, that means there is a chance of getting gold in the hard mode or or diamond if you're playing normal and if you can see there's a lot of secrets here uh just underneath uh where daniel is the south of it you can kind of see the wall it's uh it's showing a little bit extra i guess like um 
Like it's the different, little bit more of the wall. That means okay. um, there's a secret room. So you want to dig through that in order to access the secret room. Um, so what it could, what could, kind of stuff are you going to encounter in a secret room? It could be good. It could be bad. Like it could be just a bunch of enemies waiting for you. You never know. Um, it could be a really good, like a chest just waiting there for you just to, just to open it. Um, it's, yeah, you never know. It could be bad. It could be good. You're taking a chance to open up a secret room here by digging it. And sometimes you, you actually need a bomb to get to the secret room. But yeah, it's, uh, in order to, the game tells you if there is a room adjacent to the wall by exposing a little bit more of the wall. Instead of just uh, showing okay. the top-down view, it's kind of showing you a little bit, like, the side of the wall. Oh, a um, and... So it looks like Dan is going to beat the boss here. The boss has one heart left, right? Am I... Oh, he missed it. He panicked. He missed the beat. That's why the Cadence did not swing the axe here. Oh. Rather the dagger. So he, ha he cannot panic here. He actually has to be on the beat. Yeah. When the boss... Touches the wall, it gets stunned a little bit, and there you go. And then he has to make the swing on beat, but he's there keep panicking, go. he's keep missing the beat. Uh, that's why his ground is not glowing. <laughs> yeah. uh, it's, it's supposed to be like a dance floor. That's why all the enemies are dancing. If you actually look at it, like the skeletons are dancing. Like, it's, it's supposed to be a dance floor, not this. Uh, I don't know, funeral. <laughs> It's supposed to be Dan's floor. Ah. ah. Yeah, so Ryan's in a in a gold place. Austin and Bear, they're both back at the, and Rob are both back at the. That's like the first area, right? Am I seeing that correctly? Um. So I Austin currently is in in the first. So if you look at the bottom right, it tells you which zone and which level. So currently Austin is in zone oh. one, level one. So that's like the starting area. And let's take a look here with Ryan here. Um, he is in zone one, level one as well. And mm -hmm. I believe Bear Taffy has moved on to... Ah, so I guess Bear Taffy might've just died as well. It says depth one, level one. So the, the word, the wording, between the games are different. I think it's because Bear Taffy has the um, DLC. So that's oh, okay. why the wording is a bit different, but it means the same. Um, they're they're both all in the same zone, which is the first zone in the level one. There are no, a total number of three levels per zone, I believe. And every level has a boss. And in order to progress onto the next level, you have to defeat the boss so i think what just happened with bear taffy is that perhaps maybe um the boss killed him and then he could he just had to have a restart i see but yeah right now bear taffy currently what he's doing the crate that he's pushing around it might have an item just like that there's a bomb there and then on the ground there's a traps if you look at it, there's like arrows pointing down, there's some uh, trap doors, etc, etc. So he was pushing the crate next to the bomb trap. So it's a free bomb. If you were to step onto the bomb trap, it spawns a bomb. So instead of using his own bomb, what he did was he by pushing the crate next to the bomb trap, he can spawn the bomb by pressing onto the bomb trap and then save in results. Uh, save the bomb that he has and perhaps get the item that's inside of the crate. And currently right now, um, Bear Taffy just picked up the potion. You might be, uh, it's like, what is the potion? It's actually uh, plus one, like one up. If he were to die, he will use the potion and they will revive him. So he basically got a one up here. So it, uh, within the items, within the consumable items, uh, the potion is really rare to get. It's just RNG. Um, and one of the greatest items to get, to be fair. So I think Bear Taffy might be have a really, really high chance of mm -hmm. getting the high score. Um, we'll have to see. I mean, sometimes you think you're like, ah, yes, I have the, the best item right now. Uh, you know, all I got to do is just not panic. But then sometimes you just panic just because you still have to keep everything in tempo. And 
right. might be just put it in a sticky situation and you just result die and we'll see. <laughs> they haven't... I believe Bear Taffy has fought the first zone boss. So after three zones, you encounter the boss room. The boss room of the first zone, sec um, second zone, etc. Related to where they are. And uh, they have to beat the zone boss in order to move on to the next zone. So every floor has a boss and then every zone has a boss. So um, the zone bosses are really unique. For example, one of my favorite uh, boss, the zone bosses, there's a chess boss. So as you can see, like when you look at the, the lights on the ground, it kind of looks like the check checkers board in a way, chess board. So they, what they did is that they created this chess boss. So they move just like the chess piece. So if you know the chess, you know, queen can move every any direction. Knights, they can jump. Um, pawns, they can only move one up. So they actually created that and that's the boss and you have to kill the king it's super neat it's a super neat fight hopefully we'll be able to see it in near future here but what you can see bear taffy is doing um like blowing up the shopkeeper walls to get extra gold coin here um but he, current like he, he doesn't even have to pick up the gold because the one of the equipment that he has the golden ring it's automatic gold pickup so as soon as the gold spawns it will automatically pick up for you which is great because if you have like a huge range weapon like for example bows uh yeah. you can kill enemies from very far and you don't want to go all the way down to pick up the phone uh, pick up the gold so it's automatic gold pickup so that's that's plus sometimes it might not be a plus it depends on your situation but usually for this case it will be a plus and um yeah so you you were talking earlier about like one of your preferred weapons is like the spears and stuff because they give you a little more distance but are there any weapons that have to get really close but they're really powerful if you can do that or or is it always better to have something that gets you further away? In my yeah, opinion, I think the um, any weapon that gives you more distance is better. Like bows, okay. crossbows, but they are really rare to get. And sphere and longsword are quite rare. Um, other weapons like harp, it actually attacks all the tiles around you, but only one, like the one that you're adjacent to. So okay. it could be good, but then at the same time, you just have to get really used to how the weapon behaves. Cause you thought like, oh, I thought it was going to get, I thought it was going to kill that enemy. But then I didn't realize I had this weapon. It just behaves differently than the one before. And then you might just die. So in my opinion, um, even if it's stronger, I mean like every weapon. So for the damage wise, uh, they have the same damage uh so the neutral like the starting weapon they all have one um i believe it's the platinum or the diamond they have the damage too and then uh, uh what was the Ob obsidian obsidian weapons they behave they uh their damage is equal to your coin multiplier so if your coin multiplier is at one it will do one damage if your coin multiplier is two it will do two damage if your coin multiplier is at three it will do three damage so if you're really good if you're good with uh keeping up with your beat then the obsidian weapon is great um i'm trying to think so basically the weapon damage um it only matters to what it's made out of so right now bear taffy that's the obsidian whip and whip no. behaves just like if you were to think like a chess it's Absolutely it behaves not. like a knight except the jumping so it's kind of like uh what you would call it like l piece in tetris it's not like rightly in front of you it's not rightly like it's not like it's basically kind of like southwest northeast okay. kind of like yeah, yeah that that angle and it doesn't have mm -hmm. range when it comes to direct so if it's like if the monster is right in front of you it has to be like you it will kill the monster that's right in front of you instead of like a tile ahead of you so it's it's kind of like chess pieces in a way yeah the whip behaves it behaves like that so 
Um, right now, Bear Taffy is fighting the first zone boss. First zone bosses are quite easy because they're the first zone bosses. And it's the mm -hmm. Coral Riff. Um, he has multiple instruments on his tentacles. And uh, you have to kill oh, the you. tentacles in order to uh, attack the, the main body. And so main body is right now have 3 HP. Uh, because it's the first zone boss and they hmm. do spawn water puddle and when you're in the water puddle um you're stuck there for one beat so you cannot just move on to the next tile right after so it's kind of like it's like uh, your feet kind of sinking in so you have to calculate that in order like instead of just you know moving one tile ahead so right um, it's like changing the tempo exactly yeah so now, Bear Taffy has moved on to Zone 2. Yeah. He's got two levels of hearts. I'm looking at all these other guys. I mean, Ryan's doing pretty well in the heart department. Dan is on his his last leg. Austin! 69 coins. And then he's still in the tutorial, unfortunately. Oh, okay. So, yeah. Uh, and Austin just died. Wow. Oh, no. He did say uh, before... Um, uh, I think he, before you you joined um, as we were all assembling, that you get one he was away, he said he was struggling. And then he was not, you know, he's been trying, square. but he's, he, you know, it wasn't that just kind of performance you would expect from Austin, right? Just I being really good it. really quickly. So it'll be interesting square to see how it pans out over the next hour if he can kind of pull something together and uh, get in the flow. Mm hmm Yeah. I mean. Ryan also team captains. They're they're snoozing. They're they're both still doing the tutorial here. So, yeah. You know, hmm. don't snooze, please. So, so I have <laughs> I have two snooze. pretty heavy questions for you. Mm -hmm. The first one, before I forget, it was uh, suggested that I ask you: Are you do you know of like any kind of game records for Crypto the Necro Dancer? Like overall. You know, highest run ever, quickest run. Like, any? Do you have any knowledge of that kind of stuff? Oh man, I think that's not the question that I have answer for, just because I believe like the world record for is like speed running. I'm feeling pretty good. I it gotta be like two minutes. <laughs> two minutes? <laughs> Something insanely quick, that yeah. Like and for uh, high score, I'm I'm not too sure. Like, actually, the game has uh, in-game built leaderboard so you can actually see um the highest oh, score right. for each character hi, uh fastest time for each character because there are different the different characters as well up, so what's uh roughly your kind of your fastest or your best time in this if you recall for reference oh my gosh uh i never try to do speed run in this game because okay. speed speed running plays way different uh, tactics um, mm -hmm. than the high score. So okay, so what's a so you you go more after the high score? What if you're trying to do that? Um, like you said, people can do farming and stuff. Did you ever do that, or do you always prefer to play hardcore mode? Or oh no, I always play hardcore mode. Oh wow. So yeah, it's um trying to think i i honestly do not know what my high score is but there was a competition that <laughs> oh how do you, how do you so close or austin we are the, the high <laughs> high score uh the competition that so when i first started this game uh ryan got invited to um to Necrothon, I, I think it's called. So it was like Crypto Necro Dancer competition because the game was coming out really soon. And uh, there was different categories. And it the category that I actually challenged in was D on DDR PID. So you can actually play this game on DDR PID. And so I played this game on DDR PID and going for the highest score. And I believe I was unfortunately the top four I was at top three, and the last so minute, so someone actually got the water, highest, right? like a tiny bit down. higher score than me. <laughs> so I, I got to top solution. four, but um, I mean, still, that's something, right? <laughs> yeah, that's I. Anything in that realm at all is far greater than what I could do. So 
I, I just imagine playing this on DDR Pit. It's and I was streaming like twelve hours a day for a month, I think, or maybe it, it was like two weeks. But it was for the competition. I really wanted to win, so Oops. I think I was playing for twelve, streaming twelve hours a day on DDR Pit. Wow. How many hours do you have in um in this game? Like you're in the hundreds of hours then. Oh, actually 125 hours when I checked last time. Oh, wow. So it's not so insane. <laughs> I mean, that's still, I mean, that's pretty good. Um, my other question was, if you were competing in this competition right now, knowing everything you know about the game and kind of the parameters of the competition, what, what do you think your strategy would be to try and win, you know, in terms of killing shopkeepers or when you kill the shopkeepers, you know, are you going to spend a lot of time exploring? Like, I, I, I want to know what a Kate run would look like or what a run you would suggest these other guys would do to increase their chance of success. Definitely, I will tell them which um, equipments are really necessary and is really important for you and what en enemies to look out for. How enemies behave, um, you know. You're you want to. My strategy for the highest run is to kill the shopkeeper in zone two, level one. So you can get the crown of greed, and then you can. Uh, you still have enough time to farm the gold. But in order to kill the shopkeeper, I I say you need at least three bombs. So you want, you also have to save your first bomb. Do not use your bomb from um, the first floor. Oh, wait, hold on. Bear Tuffy is in the really... Oh, it's okay. Oh, maybe Bear Tuffy can get out of this. Um, but yeah, it's, uh, you want to save your bomb as, as much as you can and then have, it, have at least three uh, until you reach the zone two, level one, so you have enough to kill the shopkeeper here. Mm -hmm. But is, would it be okay if I ask you to keep the track on the score for Team Daniel? And then I can keep on like the highest score and then I can keep the keep track of the high score for Team Northern Lion here. I can do that. So um, just, to, just to make sure I don't screw anything up uh, while I get, uh, I'm going to get a separate window up for Dan and Rob. Uh, when I'm looking for the score, I'm just looking to when they die, like it'll tell me something there. Yeah, on their death screen, it says your score is. <clears throat> okay. Let me, um... So right now, Bear Tap is fighting the chest boss that I'm talking about. The boss is in the corner here. And then all, all, all those ladies with the cigar is the queen. That's the boss. Bear Tap, you're having no problem. Moving on to the zone three. Zone three. Oh my. What? Okay, now let me pull up. Robs. Austin, we gotta but uh, I can't hopefully, team captains uh, will beat the tutorial, so they can actually compete in this. Because I mean, if I were one of the 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 team member here, I would be really upset with Ryan and Daniel for not even prepared for the competition here. So Ryan this is still in the tutorial, as well. I believe so. Last time I checked, he he was in the he was still in the tutorial. Yes, he is still in the tutorial. So. So you think maybe this is part of Ryan's strategy, though? Strategy, though, right? It could be. I mean, like I said, this game, Champion Salt, is not about you know who's the best at this game. It's right. there's more than that. So he could he could also be playing the strategy that maybe perhaps Dan is also playing, but. Like I'm saying, if I if I am their uh, team members and I'm I'm doing what I can to boost up our chance to achieve the highest score for the whole team, if the team captains are snoozing, they're just doing, you know, tutorials. I, I would be upset. I would be upset. I I agree. I agree. So I think that's gonna come back to uh, to bite them, but. There, there is one thing that we're not. We, I don't, I don't. You've probably mentioned it, but um, the bonus game, right? 
the, the oh yeah 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 the Vito. yeah so even if rob austin bear are displeased with their captain's performance one of them might be safe from getting eliminated despite their team captains kind of dropping the ball right we'll have to see we we have to wait and see so right now uh daniel is breaking the rule here he's playing as the different character but because I'll, I'll let it be i'll let it slip because it's the tutorial like even if he scores you know nine million in the tutorial it doesn't count so mm -hmm. as long as he's using different character to uh clear the tutorial asap so he can actually participate in the competition then i i don't mind because i honestly expected Ladies everyone to clear the tutorial <laughs> mm -hmm. beforehand but that was that was just uh, my expectation it has been done. ryan is in zone two assault. <laughs> ryan is finally participating he can he, he can now it. actually go into all zone mode Ryan has cleared the tutorial. Ryan's the kind of guy to. I've recently, I've seen him win multiple moment, Invictus Tetris runs. I've seen him bowl a perfect 300. I've seen him do a lot of things. I think he's the kind of guy that you give him a little momentum, you put him under the spotlight, he can handle the pressure pretty well. So, yeah, he had a slow start here. Okay. Maybe he takes a run at it. I don't know. We'll see. I, Maybe I think he's... that's very fair. I, I honestly did not expect all that much from Ryan, but he still has an hour and 18 minutes to go, and uh, he's now participating in the competition by beating the tutorial. Daniel, however, is obviously still trying to beat the tutorial here oh, oh. let's just watch uh bear taffy he's still in the zone three which is awesome um and we we have to keep an eye on his high score mm -hmm. what is dan doing isn't that the question that we always ask he's he's in the shop right now he sees a ghoul dan <laughs> sword a ghoul dan key and what looks like a, a a boot with uh wings you know uh, some uh uh, some Ooh. Yeezys, perhaps. Um, I think he's he's got the dang greed. He's almost he's got 197 uh, uh, gold. Oh man! Okay, sorry to interrupt, but uh, a bear taffy is in the really heat right now. He used the potion, which was to act as a one up from the the boss, the, the floor boss here, and uh, he has two HP. There are a bunch of enemies around. He's kind of panicking, perhaps. Oh, this, he's in the trouble. He's in the trouble. He killed the boss. Oh, he killed the monsters. Uh, the floor is lava right now. He might have actually pulled himself out of the pinch here. Phew, that was really close. I mean, Daniel here, he's, he's also fighting the tutorial boss here with one HP. But, oh my god, the RNG! Bear Taffy just picked up the cookie. Five cookies on the ground. Picked it up, ate it all, recovered the HP. Now he's with the five hearts, five full hearts here. Man, that was that was really intense. The bear bear almost died, but he actually managed to turn around here. I mean, so he's looking drop. pretty. He's got thirteen hundred and fifty-two gold. That's right. In his back pocket. I mean, listen. I know I was talking Ryan up, but that seems like uh, uh, bears up top of Mount Everest right now. Ryan's not even at the halfway point. He he forgot his oxygen tank down at the base camp. Uh, you know, I mean, it doesn't really matter too much because Bear's on Ryan's team. <gasps> oh, no! Bear just died! Oh, no. Oh, he had, what, what was he the had, saying in the darkest dungeon? The overconfidence? Uh, 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 overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer! Yes! His high Bear. score being 1364. Wow. Wow, man. Honestly, he right killed now, the floor the boss. He was just, he was ready to go. He was ready to go to the next floor, but he actually just hung around thinking maybe, ah, I can grab some extra gold here and there. And then out of nowhere, a little baby monster came around and just killed him. 
that was really unexpected. You know, like as like the the wise man said, the the overconfidence. What was that again, Mouth? Overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Exactly. You hate to see it. Bear or uh, Dan also just died. Um, like so he's still tutorial land, right? Yes, that is correct. He did have a 197 gold. I you know I I don't know if that counts because he's still in the tutorial, but I figured. You oh, know. Dan didn't die. He won. Oh, he didn't. He he won. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh. He's, he's going into now. He gets to participate. He still has an hour and 14 minutes to participate. Okay. I see. So that was a little a little uh, assumption on my part. I saw an end screen. I just assumed Dan died. I mean, <laughs> uh, what can I say? We've been sitting here for an hour. He's been dying over and over. You can't blame a guy. <laughs> I mean, now both. Both team full power participating. Uh, I, I mean, it's, I think it's kind of hard to track Robert's high score just because of his internet situation here. Yes. So, um, so I'm going to keep an eye on him, but he's also kind of maybe he's trying to fix stuff because he's been on the you died screen for a couple minutes here. So I see. I'll um, keep an eye on him for you, though. If, if possible to maybe have uh, one or two people from my chat to tell Robert to have his, um, he maybe he can keep track of his own high score just because it's really hard to see his screen from our end. Yeah, his bit rate is yes, unfortunate. Uh, hopefully too. though, like his yeah. side of things are a little more clear. I guess it's probably just his stream and the internet, right? So. Yeah, it's yeah. the snow snowstorm from the east coast here. Yeah. So yeah. If he if he could keep track of his personal best score, that would that would help us a lot. I mean, we'll we'll do our best here, but currently the leader with a highest score is Team Northern Lion here. So let me just mm -hmm. add a little bit, and the current the highest score from. Team Northern is Bear Taffy with 1364. Wow. That is... I, I can... I mean... I don't know if you add up Rob and Dan's if you even get that combined by the time we're done. <laughs> that just seems like uh, such an impressive score. It's... Uh, oops. It is it is a very impressive score for sure, yes. King Konga, all right. I gotta focus. Nice. Okay, wait, I've got uh I see Jess is in my stream. I, I I've I've or no, sorry, not my stream. I'm in Rob's stream. Oops. I didn't park my car here. Um <laughs> Okay. But now Rob has started another run, so hopefully uh hopefully he'll be able to gain some. Oh, some as traction. we're talking uh austin is now fighting the conga boss which is the boss uh i think it's a zone one boss here if he manages to kill the zone one boss he will move on to the zone two however he stepped onto the booby trap here he lost a whole bunch of hp i think he's kind of panicking oh austin with a score of 556 that is not enough to beat bear taffy's score but he he got a little spooked for sure. He got he got cornered. That seems like a pretty pretty solid showing though, to be honest. You know, for a guy coming into this who was saying he he was having trouble with the game to put up 556. That seems respectable. Yeah, indeed, indeed. Oh, Ryan just getting killed by the white skeleton from. <laughs> From zone one. Oops. <laughs> Threw my fucking spear again. Now, another question. I know why it's happening too. You walk mm -hmm. into a room, up and there's an enemy. Combo for it. It's yeah. your most uh the enemy in this game you have the most difficulty with on a regular basis. Who what which enemy oh, is man. that? So later on, uh in zone four, there's this enemy that actually teleports you when when you hit them. I, I hate that one. To die and I can't die. There 
Yeah. So how do you how do you beat them if they teleport you when you hit them? You just kind of keep getting teleported and you keep going yeah, back and then and you forth go until back and then you damage them. Yeah, if you don't have enough damage, uh, you gotta you gotta attack them. They teleport you and then you gotta find them again and then you gotta kill them. <laughs> Are there so, any weapons or, or items that kind of circumvent that teleportation at all? No. Right. So in order to kind of kill that thing without pain free is either have the monster be really close to you. So if it, if it teleports you, you're just only teleporting like left to right. Okay, you know, it's okay, not like a huge a difference. And okay. also, um, if you have yeah, enough damage. So let's say you have that. maximum of three damage with your weapon, and then you have a damage up item remember. from like damage ring, oh, and then you have damage up from your boots, then you have five damage that you're playing with. with. So you can probably, mod, like backwards. with five damage, Dance you can kill lots of things with one shot. So that, that would be the way that I will combat that. Um, if you were to only backwards. have default damage and default equipment, then it's really hard to combat it. That's why I hate that enemy. Okay. But I also hate bats. Bats are everywhere. And Ooh, their the movement pattern is unpredictable. Possible. Sometimes they just move vertically. Sometimes they move horizontally. They just, sometimes they just move diagonally. It's really hard to predict, especially like the um, normal bats. They're kind yeah. of like darkish blue. They're easier to kill it's them. But then uh, later on, you will encounter red bats. Red bats move really fast, and they, they don't have like a set pattern. Right, they just kind of move wherever they want to go. So it's it's really annoying. Because sometimes you think like, oh, that bat is just going to move to the right. But then actually move to the left, and it kills you. It's like, the, it, that sometimes right, bats, right. they're just run-enders. They're really annoying. Is it better to like, you know, if you're in a room move kind of to the center or move up against kind of one end or a wall does that help at all or are they just so random it's not gonna matter all you want to do uh, i think for for my experience uh, what you want to do out. is to get a range weapon so it doesn't yeah, matter if it's moving left or right you, you have okay. one tile in between like one tile buffer in between the uh, enemy and yourself so that way you don't have you don't you're not right next to the enemy you're not, so it's, it won't attack you. Um, but if you don't have that luxury, oh, yeah, I then I, I, I would say weird. just, that that just roll the dice. <laughs> Unfortunately, it's, yeah, it's hard to, yeah, the bats, I think most of the players will agree, bats are contribute to the salt mine, one of the worst enemies, for sure, because their over, movement pattern is random. How to take care of it. Um, yeah, I can't I tell die, if Rob just died. <laughs> I feel so bad for him. Um, so I see bear 690 coins, no big deal. What's your, what's your odds that bear actually surpasses his past, his previous run? Let's see his equipment here. So he has item, the chicken leg. I think that recovers two and a half or three full HP, uh, which is really good. And he has the, um, sphere, which is one of my favorite weapon. So that has, it actually has two range. Um, and I think that is the diamond weapon, so it's two damage. And he has a chain mail for the body, so it actually decreases the uh, damage intake by half, I believe. But then he also has the sunglasses, and the sunglasses it's a plus one damage up for you. However, you cannot see the enemy, yeah, you should only like see the enemy. shadow of the enemy. So uh, it's kind of a uh, little bit risky. However, if he's going for plus one damage definitely that's the item for it and then the ring um that's plus one damage ring so he definitely oh that oh, was no. very close from bear taffy oh he's gonna oh, oh there you go so he he does so that's, solid that's the shadow dragon there. shooting fire no that's that was the red dragon the only reason uh Bear Taffy saw it as a shadow is because he is wearing the sunglasses here. He can see oh. the color of the enemies. He can only see the shadow of them. Um, but I mean, but still he's doing like really, really good damage here. Because the, all the damage stacks up, right? Like plus two from mm -hmm. the weapon, plus one from the sunglasses, plus one from the ring. So he's doing solid four damage here. So that's, that's wonderful. He got the feet. So that's the ballerina shoes. So because it's the glass, if he gets 
a hit, it will shatter. But um, ballerina, ballerina shoes is awesome. Uh, I believe ballerina shoes, what it does is that you never miss a beat, even if you were to miss a beat. So mm -hmm. it oh. keeps your multiplication going, which is great. But because it's made out of glass, if you were to get hit, that will shatter. And he won't have that item anymore, so he has to be really careful. Oh, there's a mole! Okay, he killed it. So what do uh, moles yeah. do? They just, they're just an enemy, they just dig around. You can attack them while they're burrowed on, underneath. You can only attack them once they show up. Okay. Is there any rhyme or reason to where they'll, they'll show up? Like, is it within a certain radius of you, or they're just anywhere in the room? Usually they follow you. I think it's just like after, you know, eight beats, maybe they will show up or something like that. But you just gotta, um, instead of waiting for them to show off, the easiest way to do is to attack them. I know you can attack them when they're bored underneath, but if you were to attack them, they will show up. Or not, I guess, attack, but like if you are right next to them as they are. Mm -hmm. It's hard to explain. It's, uh, so like if they're, let's say, going north, if you were to block their path, the mole will show up and then you have the exact moment to kill the mole. If you were to wait a, a beat, then the mole will attack you. So okay. that's that's the way to combat things. So the ring there with the, the question mark, question mark, question mark, the 180 coin ring uh, currently that Bear Taffy is seeing, that one is the... I, don't, I forgot the name of that ring. But it's just like, um, what it does is that it, when you're wearing it, if you get hit, you die. It doesn't matter. You just take 999999 damage and it oh, kills no. you. But if you actually bring it to one of the secret shop, and then if you trade the ring with the secret shopkeeper, it tr uh, he gives you this uh, plus one to all stats weapon. Or the so this is, this is a high T move. That we're yeah, seeing. if he if he were to get that um, ring and then finds to uh, finds the secret sh shopkeeper who will trade the ring, then he will give you. I forgot what the item is like a guardian angel or something like that, and it gives you plus one to every stat. So mm -hmm. I try to do that, but it's really risky. You you end up just dying all the time. So, so you I think, really I mean, it. had Bear not uh, put up such an impressive score last round, he probably wouldn't try to do that this round? Do you think he's kind of doing it just because he's in... I have to imagine he, he's assuming he's in a fairly comfortable lead, right? Uh, maybe, maybe, but I mean... It's uh, the score, so... What you're... Um... The score, how we de we de how we determine the score is by the gold. And in order mm -hmm. to buy items from the shop, you have to spend the gold as well. So let's say right. you have two thousand gold, but there's a really good item selling in the shop, and then it's five hundred gold. Then you spend it, it goes down to fifteen hundred, and then if you were to die at that point, then your high score is fifteen hundred, not two thousand, right. because you spent it. So it's kind of a tricky situation where, like, if you were to not spend much money. And, um, like I said, get the, the crown of greed, get those, um, just, uh, save bunch of bombs and blow up the shopkeeper's wall and pick up all the, oh, sorry, that the question mark, question mark, question mark ring was the, not the right ring. It was actually the ring that Daniel is seeing. It's the skeleton ring. My bad. I got, oh, I got okay. too mixed up, but, but, um, yeah, if you were to get the crown of greed, and uh, blow up all the shopkeeper's wall then it is possible to achieve like really high score so just to give a perspective here um bear taffy's high score 1364 currently i could achieve that probably by the end of easily actually easily by the end of zone two um, oh, wow. If if I were to get the crown of greed and blow up all the the shopkeeper's wall, so it's it's not about making the further progress. It's about farming the gold. So all that money, yeah. Well, like if, speaking of lots of money, uh, Dan did just die. Um, 
I'm not sure if you saw the amount of money uh, that he had, Kate. If not, I would like you to guess how much he died with. I did not see it. I would like to guess 120. Uh, you're mm, about 99 too high. <laughs> <laughs> then uh, he finished with 21, you know? Um, <laughs> 21 Yeet Street. Uh, Bear. You know? But he, he's putting he, he's he's running his sets, I guess. Uh, he's 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 putting his uh, his best foot forward, and he's he's back on a new run. So let's see if he can if he can get over that. Because I think he, he had more money at one point. I haven't been paying too close of attention to him, but I think he probably spent some money on some some mm -hmm, Yeezys or, or something fancy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean. And, we we cheer on. I mean, for you, you you should cheer for Team G, Team Dan G. <laughs> I'm I'm equal footing here. I ch I cheer for Dan Giesling fifty percent. I cheer for Team Northern Lion fifty percent. Let's uh, see. I mean, look at Bear though. Bear Cap is just yeah. Moving on. I mean, this is the place that where he got murdered last time. So he I I'm murdered. pretty sure he knows. Okay. You know. He should not be overconfident with anything. He should always be careful. Right. I mean, the way he's playing um, is, oh is very safe. Like, he's, he wants to play really, really safe. If he were to play, like, a glass cannon style, he could easily get, I don't know, um, early thousand scores by zone two, pretty much. I, I remember, like, my high score being, like... I don't know, Chet. I, I don't know if Chet remembers, because... I maybe it was like I was you trying to get guess. five thousand. It was pretty high up, like. So it, it is possible to get five k, eight k, or even higher actually. Um, wow. So you might think like, wow, you know, thirteen sixty four. That's that's untouchable. Nah, nah. You can. It's very doable for I think everybody here. Do you think anybody's like ever gotten like over ten thousand? Is that? possible uh, like if you have enough time or like I'm, is there is there a hard cap or, or anything in the game on how much money you could ultimately get or is there no real limit i guess there is a hard cap in a way that the game finishes once you complete right like there's oh, okay. a total That's of four fair. zones yeah. total of four zone bosses so once you once you uh you know do everything then yes that's there should be a hard cap um so like, can Origin, they, could... what I'm getting is that Origin said 10k and 10k Origin considers that 10k is a low score. So oh. yeah, I mean, I mean, Origin played this game a lot as well. Mm -hmm. So okay, but like I'm seeing on uh, like I'm watching Austin right now, and there's some of the walls when he's digging. They're like a they're like a, a darker kind of gray. Is that like a other boundaries? ultimately for how far you can dig oh yeah, yeah. there the map is set and uh if you were to have a higher level torch they will actually show you um like and then also on the bottom right it's the minimap so you can see the mini map and then it, like what you want to do is you want to explore as much as you can but there isn't it's not going to expand forever like minecraft mm -hmm. it's gonna it has a set amount the song ends okay uh, and just something to, to clear, because I, I I saw it uh, posted here, the the t the winning team it's not a combination of their scores. Whichever person has the the highest score, that team wins. That's um, Because obviously it wouldn't be very fair for uh, Dan and Rob, right? They'd be at a pretty big disadvantage. So, mm -hmm. um, but that said, I don't know. I I'm watching Bear, and it's it's pretty impressive he's uh he's putting on a clinic right now and, uh, <laughs> actually I mean, if you want to know a little bit of more of the secret here in this zone um if you were to have stack of over 100 gold on the ground um what's the what's the the guy with the green hat with the clover he shows up saint patrick i forgot the name of that like a uh, leprechaun? Yeah, it's a leprechaun. Leprechaun. Leprechaun shows up and leprechaun steals your gold. But if you were to catch up to the leprechaun and kill it, not only you get your gold back, you get this charm of uh, luck. And uh, 
Like, okay, so there's different ways. For Leprechaun, if you were to hit the Leprechaun and not kill it right away, as he runs away from you, he drops a bunch of gold. So you can get a bunch of gold from that. Um, if you were to kill it right away, he drops the uh, the Charm of Luck. So if it's, that's, uh, it gives you, I think, plus two on your stat for your luck. So um, that'll just mean like you're going to get better drops every yeah, time? Yeah, you, you have a thing? higher chance to get better drops from the shop or from just the floor spawn. But yeah, one of the... I guess like for the score runs, what you want to do is like obviously you want to have the crown of greed and then spawn the leprechaun uh, with a stack of 100 gold I believe on the ground and then you have to kind of like let it sit there for a little bit and the leprechaun shows up and then once it spawns it runs away because it stole your gold but when you catch up to it and do enough damage to the leprechaun but not to kill it, it actually runs away from you um, by, like while it's dropping gold. And if you lose track of that guy, he goes away, and then you lose him forever, so you want to uh, kill him at the end, or you, you do lose money, but... Oh, Bear Taffy with Ryan, 1 HP. Ryan just died with 148 gold. Ooh, you know, I think he's a big spender. Yes. Ryan is big spender. I think, uh, you know, he's trying to... to go for survival in a prolonged run but mm -hmm. i i don't know maybe maybe we'll see do you think maybe he might go for uh because we have about 40 minutes left maybe a more aggro bush maybe the glass cannon if you will or do you think he's gonna just try to play it safe i think he's trying to play safe but you know it's it depends how it's gonna play out right maybe i mean it's not the point of who can get to the end it's the point of who can get the most coin here so he, he he should probably find a happy medium here mm -hmm. <laughs> and not spend too much gold in the shop. But, mm -hmm. I mean, as you progress further and further in the game, monsters do drop more gold. Right. So, and also, one of the um, important thing, if you were to not lose the coin multiplier in the boss dur during the whole boss fight, oh. um... The boss drops huge lump sum. Like, just just like that. Bear Taffy just picked up 600 gold from one Oh boss. my god, he's almost at 2,500. Yeah, by by not missing a beat and just uh, just one hit KO that boss. And uh, so the boss bored. just gave you 600 gold. If he were to lose the, the, the three coin multiplier, obviously divide that by three. And he will, he will only I pick uh, 200 gold there, so... Okay. That's a huge difference. That's why you want to keep the beat. You do not want to lose your beat combo. Now, Bear Taffy actually moved on to the final zone here. Zone 4. So zone 4, is it's insane. Harpies, they freaking come to jump around, come and net you. Um, that's the guy that teleports you with the wand here. Oh, yeah. I got, he got confused. That guy... Um, the knight, he actually counters your attack, so you actually have to know exactly how he moves. The guy with the... Oh, that's the, that's the teleporter guy right here. Yep, he got teleported as he killed. Um, the spider on the wall, they attack you if you get too close to them. So you want to destroy the wall and then kill the spider or you just ignore them. You don't have to kill all the monsters. Um, there's another teleporter guy, so you want to kill the teleporter guy at the last. So he's okay, I was just going to ask what the priority is, but I guess if you try to attack him first, he might teleport you into another enemy, right? Exactly. So you want to kill a teleporter guy the last if possible. I see. So the well, knights are really annoying. When you attack them, they will counter you, so you have to dodge where you were standing and then attack where you were standing in order to kill oh, like a, the Oh, so you got to kind of like parry them or, or counter attack. Exactly. Okay. So, it's all, so like, all these on... enemies here is That's just awesome. really annoying. Hmm. Do you think Bear being on one heart, like, it, if he gets hit once, he's kind of dead at this point? Yeah, at this point, even with the good equipments here, anything could just kill him. It, a trap. You know, if you if you can see on the right side of all. Oh, Oh, that's the that's the trap here. He's gonna be a firebomb. Oh, he actually wow. dodged that. He realized that. Okay, now he time he needs to kill the red dragon here. Okay, easy money, sixty one oh coin. Oh, gosh. 
Again, he dodged. He, he dodged the trap on the right here with the fire. That was that was very dangerous. Sometimes you don't see that because it's just it's just in the corner of your screen, and if you just get hit by that, you just you're de you're dead. So we'll it's really frustrating. But what can you do, right? Yeah. He's currently at twenty eight fifty two. So the coffin there actually spawns the monster. So what you want to do instead of killing all the monsters that's spawning, you want to kill the coffin ASAP. But I uh -oh. think he's, I think Bear Taff is trying to get to the coffin. He got teleported. Another oh, no. fire bomb. We've got oh, okay. issues elsewhere too, Kate. Dan is in the front seat. He is hurting. I, it's, he keeps dying. He just died with zero gold, Kate. I don't. I don't know how. How do we? Oh, you've Matt. got. Oh, oh, there you go. I think I caught off a little bit. Oh, sorry. Um, yeah, it's just opposite ends of the spectrum. Dan is uh, struggling something fierce, and you got Bear near three thousand gold. Three, almost and... three thousand gold. And uh, I mean, he could also. I believe there is still a shop here. So if he, if he wants to get better score, he does have one extra bomb, so he could blow up the wall of the the shopkeeper, or the shop here. But we'll see. Yeah. Oh, Ryan's trying to talk to Bear right now, but I I don't think that's the right time right now. <laughs> oh. This zone, you know, not you don't you don't know what's gonna. What's beyond the wall, so you mm -hmm. just gotta be careful. Yeah, in Ooh. interesting. A little behind the scenes for uh, people in the in the uh, Rob and Dan in their own little Discord room, and Dan has been fully deafened <gasps> and muted, so there's zero communication between Rob and Dan. And I've got to think, um, you know, what what does that what does that do? To rob mentally that his own team captain is ignoring him. To... Oh yeah. no, Bear Taff, he got killed by the wall spider with a score of thirty three thousand one hundred eighty five. Now that's that's a pretty decent score here. I think that would be really hard to beat. I mean, we got a half hour here. You know, uh, you need a pretty special run. It seems to uh, to even. I'd come anywhere near that. I, I mean, I, I guess it's probably feasible, right? But that's... I don't think we have the expertise amongst the others to uh, to match that. We'll, we'll see. Let's see here. Let's uh, update our Bear Taffy's score. I think Bear Taffy happy with his current score. Um, let's tune into Ryan. Ryan's a 111 gold. <laughs> He's got a combo going. I can see all the the Let's colors on the floor. Suit. He's in zone uh, zone one. Zone level one, level two, yeah. But he has, interestingly enough, he actually has a rifle. So rifle, you actually have to reload. So sometimes oh. it's a great weapon. It has a knockback, which is kind of you know risky. But as you can see, in order to Reload, you have to press the up down button at the same time. So, Steam if you were to really be on the DDR Vladimir pad, you have to jump and then press those two ah. buttons at the same time. Um, and I believe it can have only one ammo. I'm not too sure. Actually, rifle, it's it's a rare weapon, so I have right. never used it. Yeah, it, it seems looks like, like he only has one ammo. It looks like there's no, like, as long as it has line of sight, there's no range on it. I yeah, guess, it's like, like maximum like, range, it seems like. Oh, yeah. but Ryan... Oh, he's he's painting himself a into a corner game. here. Thanks to our friends at Brace Yourself. Man. Game. Yes, thank you. For sponsoring this know. week's second I think of it seems Friday. like the maybe the, the rifle's a bit too advanced or risky for a competition the, uh, like this. Point. I don't know. I, I, I think he, it's command. his first time using the, the rifle. And... Yeah, so Ryan's keep Transport missing his shot. NL aim. Coming to Steam yeah. on December 11th. Potato aim, NL aim. Over at Good Shepherd Entertainment. Thanks to them for sponsoring the entire Champions of Salt tournament as well. Thank you, Bear Taffy, thank for the ed. Thank you, Bear Taffy. For yeah, thank you, Bear Taffy. Doing the shot. 
I'll tell you what, for dude, reading I'm out good at reading showing. out the things that is I'm necessary. Not commenting on that at all. Well, you know, uh, he's kind of put himself in a pretty comfy position to be. Uh, mm -hmm. If I were him, I'll be brewing my tea and just sipping on my tea. Look, I'm in the middle of <laughs> Sitting back, you know. Yeah, who knows? Maybe you've never played a game with guns. It might be a good move on his part to just sit back and and kind of consult the others a little bit, help them out, because it's gonna it's gonna make him look good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I right? think that's it's a good gonna strategy. Help with the, yeah. The the voting. I, I I don't know what else he could do to really improve. I I, I truly don't think there's a, a risk for him at this point. But I, I think what he needs to do is damage control because he's so far and away the winner. People might mm. seriously want to put him on the block. That's Actually, true. That's true. Because he's, you know, biggest. like I said, this game is not about who's best at games. Worst. It's it's a bit more than that. Yeah. And so if he he's in a way he's the strongest player here, but maybe that would actually well, backfire him. Right. We'll, we'll yeah. see. We uh, we uh, shall uh, see. Um, so it is. I was just gonna say one more thing before yes. uh, you know, just a I'm reminder honest. to people that so this week still Dan and Ryan have immunity, correct? That is correct. However, next week that immunity goes away. It's out the window, baby. Mm -hmm. So. Dan's really going to have to run his sets if he wants a chance. Oh, but he's doing pretty well now. Right. He's on next test. level, 252 Yo, gold. Uh, you on. know, respectable. What would be the Team Daniel's oh, high score if you, if you were oh, to you. know the number? <laughs> I mean, right now, like, our, so we're not going to include the number Dan got when he beat the tutorial, right? That is correct, because that is the tutorial. Yeah. So right now, the only one I've seen is 21 by Dan. <laughs> so, I mean, Rob, I think probably has more than that, but um, I can't I can't tell. So hopefully we'll ha we have a few um, delegates in, in Rob's like uh, chat keeping, keeping track. Um, but I mean, if Dan were to die right now, you know, that's true. That's that's the Team it. Daniel's high score with the 318. We just have to see yeah. if he's gonna spend that money to get a better weapon, or I'm guessing that I mean, hole is bad. they should go for broke here. 3,185 is a score that they need to beat. 321. That's not good enough. That's not good enough. You know. No rush. I think I think at this point, Dan wants to just get a run that he can feel. <laughs> you know okay about you don't want to you don't want to end the competition under a hundred gold you know okay maybe he's not gonna crack <laughs> well, 343 that the sound of water drinking was kind of gross 343 guilty spark that's um wow i don't know i think Less than half an hour. We'll we'll see what they can do. There we go. Austin. Uh, All right, he's under a hundred. Ryan just passed a hundred. Humble beginnings, humble pie. Thanks, Jim. <laughs> Those monkeys are dangerous. I'll grab you. Oh, let's see here. I think. Digimol strats. Austin, I think Austin, his furthest progress is actually zone two, I believe. You know, what's interesting is that actually I expected Maltese. a bit he does, more he does a from rap. Ryan. Because I have mm -hmm. played this game many of times like with Ryan. This is not his music. first time. Um, yeah. We played this game on DDR pad. We played this game together when game uh, he was ah! on keyboard as well. <laughs> But I just think maybe he's choking. He's choking a little bit. I mean, I think he, he has seen the zone three and everything, but <laughs> he's just he's choking. Maybe he's uh the the pressure's getting to him a bit, and you know I know we Austin not very familiar, but he's a very uh, musically inclined individual. You know he plays piano, which is obviously a a, a difficult instrument you know but he, he it's not like it's a foreign thing to him so to see him kind of struggling a little bit more with the the rhythm and the flow that's uh kind of kind of surprising to me to be honest as a past team daniel there. member 
Um, what percentage do you think that Team Daniel will be able to win this game? Well, I mean, I already gave you my my <laughs> percentage last night <laughs> of uh, has has that three percent improved? Really oh, absolutely like not. Um, <laughs> you know, I knew I knew going into this, uh, I had heard that Bear had like, some is experience with it. Mm -hmm. But seeing him John Delaney, climb over three thousand, I, John Delaney, I, I would. Oh, I know. I'm not a gambling man, but. You know, you I would play. be willing to put money Live at Radio City Music that Hall. There it is. Dan and to die. Rob don't stand a chance. Access that part of my brain. <laughs> you know, actually, well, what you, I might do. If you have to give me the number, what will be the number here? What the, be the percent percentage? chance that they that they can I'm win? Mm -hmm. oh, apparently I legitimately one percent chance. One percent. One percent. What would be the scenario that do you think it would be the robber that's I mean, actually gonna <laughs> top Bear Taffy's score, or do you think it would be Dan Geasley? Cool um, I mean, to be honest, it's really hard to tell how Rob is playing. Um, so I think you know, Dan, honestly, putting up 343, <laughs> um, is not bad. I think it's a it's a it's a shift. <laughs> right before that run, we saw him step into the front seat. To consult his chat, Dude, I don't know what he said and what they said. I've got a feeling they said to to take the the dang reed and put it in his back pocket for a little bit. Just try to just try to get in the flow. I think he got a little too allured by all the uh, the items, which obviously can help him out. But I think he's got to learn the fundamentals a bit more before he starts spending a, all the gold on peek. on that stuff. So I think he's just gotta he's gotta focus and and play well and worry a bit less maybe Big about some time. of the some of the items. So because um, it seems to me he's so new to the game that like you said, some of the items are really good. Mm -hmm. But I don't think if you're not good enough, you can't really leverage them. So you're almost throwing money away. Ryan with his rifle looked like it could be pretty good if you got the hang of it. But until you get the hang of it, it almost seems like some of the powerful items will hinder you. Um, again, that's just that's from a more outside perspective because I don't know much about the game. But that's kind of what I think uh, has been happening with. Um, Right. Dan and, and and maybe even uh, Ryan to a little bit here. So mm -hmm. no, I, I agree. Yeah. I think I think they definitely had plenty of time to yeah, practice, but I think they. I don't know if if that was part of the plan, but to the both team captains I, thought ah, I can just dive so this in, like maybe perhaps you know achieve what they <laughs> want perhaps maybe dan geasley want to achieve the goal of maybe Can hey i want to look like a weak player here i don't want to i don't want to threaten he any other players so maybe that's yeah. why he's achieving here we, we never know but yeah. in order to win this round in crypt of necrodancer definitely needed more practice from both team captains um and i think i think they're doing their best they're doing their best <laughs> mm -hmm. but if I were to give the percentage for uh, Team Daniel to win uh, Team Northern Lion, honestly, I would say my number has not changed. Uh, at, at the very beginning, I did give the minus 10%, and I think minus, it still wow. is the minus 10%. Wow. I mean, I can't really argue with that. I mean, the only reason I, I gave 1% is I... I don't even know what minus ten percent really, really <laughs> means. Like, but uh, you know, I uh, this is the kind of thing you know um, to to reference a show called The Office, and basically there's a character who likes to gamble a lot, and he says if there's ever anything where somebody or something has a ten thousand to one odd of winning, mm -hmm. which obviously means like it's very unlikely they're gonna win, you just put twenty bucks on it. So right now, I'm kind of saying, I think Dan and Rob are in that 10,000 to 1 chance that they win. And if there was an outlet for me to say, here's the 20 bucks, I would do it. Because, hey, you know, I'm throwing away 20 bucks most likely. But if I win, <laughs> uh, early retirement, baby. So... <laughs> I'll, I'll take your $20. All right, there we go. <laughs>
Can't Just know you're gonna have to pay me a lot back when Dan also, puts up it, the most dialed run you have ever seen. He's got uh, 20 minutes. <laughs> Currently, uh, both team they actually do have 35 Again, like minutes and 14 seconds because we just start a little oh. bit later. My bad, my bad. Um, but. I mean, Daniel just got hit by oh, yeah, the Tintus me. Skeleton, yeah, losing up. 2 HP, and oh, but he you killed it, um, but he bad. he has 144 coin right now. Actually, Austin, we're watching Austin's perspective, he got, he just got one of the best items, a, a Blood Sphere, so okay. it has one damage, but every 10th kill, it recovers HP, so... If he can actually manage to kill a bunch of uh, monsters here, he will recover his HP. So survivability has the survivability chance has gone up by a lot for guess. Austin here. Good he just guess. gotta get guess. some damage Good up guess. um items, maybe Great perhaps like damage up ring, right. bracelet, uh armor, uh shoes, anything like that. That would that would help yeah, out a lot. Ooh, but got hit by so Wrath. Fighting the the first floor boss. Managed to kill the first floor boss, and I think Austin will move on. So, in a lot of the, like, I see some of the, the rooms are obviously much smaller and, and some are much larger. Do you ever, is that a regular strategy to try and kite enemies into larger rooms uh, if you can? Or are you in the camp that, oh, okay, I'm just going to try and kill them in this room as quickly as possible so it depends on enemy if uh, if it's if the enemy has maybe perhaps like you need a breather maybe you have to think like oh maybe it's like it's gonna shoot fire beams you definitely want to fight them in a bigger room um but if the enemy actually teleports around it attacks really quick then you want to kill them in the small space like asap so it's just really knowing <laughs> in this game helps out a lot so if you know how the enemies behave then you can kind of work around with like oh you need to kill that enemy in a small room you need to kill that enemy in the bigger room things like that huh. so bear taffy actually fighting the first zone boss Congo boss, I think he's just gonna one hit that. Yep, flawless victory here. He's gonna pick up a whole bunch of cash, 150 coin, and he has a choice wow. of uh, red chest, purple chest, black chest. Red chest tend to have consumables, so if you're running low on HP, you wanna open the red chest, and maybe you will get cookies or chicken legs. Uh, purple chest tend to have spells, so if you want some spells or maybe rings, such. Things like that, uh, you want to open purple chest. Uh, if you are lack of equipment, like you know, defensive, offensive, weapons, or gear, you want to open up the black chest. And because uh, Bear Taffy, having the long sword, uh, and then it's it's a damage two long sword, which is one of the best weapon in the game. Um, I, he's like, and then he also has a damage up ring here, or damage up bracelet. So. He doesn't need more... any more offensive equipment, so I think that's why he went for the red chest, perhaps thinking he could get uh, pretty, uh, rare, more honestly. consumables item-wise. Mm -hmm. yeah. We'll see. I, I believe he got a torch from it, and torch lets you see the map more. Okay. So that's always going to be good for kind of making you yes. move through more quickly and, and mm -hmm. strategizing yeah. being able to see um. the enemies way ahead helps out a lot oh but then bear taffy in the pinch maybe he should eat the cheese he has consumed the cheese and Oof. then he's activated his spell which is the shield spell yeah. immune to damage for a couple of seconds here and now he cleared the floor so he, he now can move on well. but still 448 i think that's a still pretty low score for uh, yeah. Death to level one. Well, uh, Dan did just die a couple minutes ago again. Um, he actually he managed to get a slightly better score, uh, three hundred and sixty-three this time. So that's twenty more than his last run. So I kind of you know we're seeing a little bit of consistency with Dan, which is a good sign. Improving little by little. Yeah. So I mean, if he can keep. 
doing that consistently, I think so much fucking fun. He's, he's, it's going to be good, but uh, so fun, it might be man. too little too late. We'll see. We'll life. see. We'll I mean, see. 30 minutes, some might say, you know, the glass is half yeah, empty. Some might say the glass is half full. <laughs> we might see some miracle happen, but, you know, I mean, honestly, if, if I if I were to be in Team Dan Giesling's team here, I would definitely give advice. Like, you got to play glass cannon right now. If you just play safe, you're just going to lose. If you want to win, you got to kill the, the shopkeeper. Got to get the crown of greed. Got to get the leprechaun. You got to get whatever you can to boost up your score ASAP. Because if you're mm -hmm. going going for a safe run here, it's it's time consuming in order to build up the safe run in order to farm better weapons, better equipment. That's going to eat a lot of time here. So if you can just yeah. quickly kill a uh, shopkeeper, even from zone one, who cares? Just go for it and see yeah. how far you can get to within the score perspective. Because if he, if he were to just play steady, slow, I don't think that's the tactic if, yeah. if you are looking to win in this round. Oh, it's it's the 11th hour. It's, it's time for a Hail Mary. You just got to go for it. <laughs> we tried. Yeah, yeah, exactly. like you That's, said though. This, this is it. This is the place that you don't have place to return. You just gotta, you cannot go for safety now. You you yep. really do have to go for glass cannon play style. But we'll see. We'll see here. Oh, that's a great spell picked up by Dan Giesling. Um, that actually heals, uh, I believe, uh, one heart. And the skill do recharge for every 15 kills. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just saw Dan take a big old bite of a sandwich. It looks like he's uh, <laughs> getting some energy to fuel, and he died with 69 gold. 69 gold. Nine coins. You gotta stay coins. dialed in and focused. You take a bite of a sandwich, and that's your last bite, brother. <laughs> So that's the last bite. I mean, what would you be? Would you be happy if you were to be, let's say, Rob got out last week and you are in, and you're still playing with Team Daniel? Would you be? What would what would be the thing that you would like to say right now to Team Daniel here? I mean, I I played a lot of games with Dan. I've watched him play a lot of games. Um, he's just not. He's not. It's okay. You can say it. You can say yeah, it. Yeah, he's not. He's not dialed in. You know, um, and as a team captain, I think you gotta you gotta put the team above all else. You know, um, and I don't think he's doing that. You know, the sandwich is a <laughs> is a very telling thing to me because it means he wasn't prepared going into this. You know, uh, I I I made myself some dinner. I ate food i was ready to go this guy's over here in between levels he's he's taking bites I, you know that's that's disrespect to rob in my opinion and uh you know i uh, i think it's a good thing rob can't can't see that because it's probably not gonna make him too happy right now um, oh man and, and also you just said or you told me about half an hour ago they're not even communicating between each other and still not dan is Fully muted and and deafened. There, um, I haven't seen um, any seen conversation his, his, between his microphone. Yeah, none none of that. So wow. uh, I guess I do I do understand. You know, maybe there was an agreement like, okay, let let's both do our own thing and focus because the more you talk and the more you banter, it's it's yeah. using up those brain. Uh, those brain up. cells and <laughs> and it's harder to focus on the game so uh mm -hmm. i get that but i don't know maybe even just checking in in between runs just to to tell each other how they're doing but i don't i don't think they've been doing that so even if they i mean i i see that some people said they were talking time to time but like okay. compare compare to team northern lion here that is not enough as a team captain you gotta really pull through you gotta yeah. pull your way you, not only just your way you gotta also pull your teammates weight here but mm -hmm. just kind of abandoning rob here and just kind of checking in like how are you guys doing you know i think that's not good enough i think he needs to do a bit more maybe they can share a little, little tips I, I mean, I Robert, he said he had nine hours in last night, so yeah. maybe Robert has some tips, but maybe 
Dan doesn't even want to listen to it. Who knows? Agreed. I mean, that's a, it's a big thing in sports, right? Um, you know, a team is down, and you see maybe it's hockey, right? Sometimes guys get into fights, and you think, oh, that's silly. But that can charge up your team. That can kind of make you rally back. It gives you a certain energy. So if if Dan and Rob were kind of able to communicate and and here the other one is is doing well or succeeding you feed off of that energy and that that propels you forward it propels the whole team forward so mm -hmm. um you know i think this kind of being focused in uh very much could uh could kind of backfire on them in a way i, so. I think so too i mean i cannot say for robert but if if i were be a robert i think i would pretty much be unhappy with how my team captain is doing here yep. so if if robert were to go home tonight i i think i know what to expect from robert <laughs> i uh i i agree as somebody who's uh been in a similar <laughs> boat recently i i can tell you where uh my my allegiance uh <laughs> Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't. I don't feel like I was ever truly part of that that team with the the way Dan was uh, kind of. Uh, I don't want to say running things last week because he wasn't really running. He um, at, at the start he just said, "Hey, uh, Malf and Rob, why don't why don't you do it?" You know. Right. And even even that he just he just he he wasn't there to like, hey, let's let's go, let's do this. He's just like, yeah. why don't why don't you do it? Let me just sit down and do nothing and to me the sign of a of a good leader lead by example you know show show the rest of the people okay i'm i'm willing to do this and then they buy into it it gives them confidence to say well if he's willing to do it you know if this guy's in the front line of a war <laughs> charging at some horses and and blood spears and and whatnot then here i'll i'll go down with the ship too but I don't know. Dan hasn't uh, exhibited that leadership uh, in the last round, and it doesn't look like he's doing that in this one either. So we'll it's, see it's how. A, it's a weird yeah. game that he's playing for sure. I, I honestly expected maybe he will play like you know, let's go, let's do this, everyone, let's pull our weights together. But mm, you know, we'll see. We'll see though. Maybe that's this is maybe exactly what he wants. Could be. Could be. You know, a lot of times you think Dan is is down and out uh but he's like a rat in a corner right <laughs> um a lot of times he just finds he finds a way so we, we i guess we, you're right we shouldn't we shouldn't assume uh that maybe this is going exactly the way he planned you know mm -hmm. he's uh he's really good at hiding his intentions that's for sure yeah. that's that's for sure yeah. i mean i mean just by just by the look of it it looks like he's trying his best but he he did take a bite of a sandwich as his yep. run was going while time was time was ticking down. Um, but I mean it's maybe a time and a place, you know. Yeah, you know it's. I mean I I get it. Maybe he's a little peckish, but we do we do get a break uh, after this segment is over. So he could have waited for that. I'm not sure. We'll see. Maybe he just needed a little bit more fuel. For his yeah. brain power, we'll see. We'll see. Well, you'll if it, if it's okay at that during the break, if I could ask him what kind of sandwich it, it is. Oh, um, definitely. Please go ahead. Everyone okay. have it is looking okay. forward to know. Just uh, <laughs> I would like you know him to share with the rest of the class, and and maybe that'll that'll help the others kind of be like, oh, you're doing that, Dan? Huh? <laughs> I thought we were competing, my friend. A little bit of extra salt. Yeah. Is welcome. You know? Definitely extra salt oh. here and there. Wait, there was a skill good, good, good. So how much time do we got left? Uh, we're, we're getting down to the, the last lap, eh? Yeah, oh, we have Ryan. another... <laughs> Ryan just died, 181. 181 from Ryan. That's that's not even better than Dan Giesling's score. But, that's, um... half of, that's half of Dan's score. <laughs> Literally half of Dan's score um but for the time we have 20 minutes left about 20 minutes left i it will, i wonder if ryan is a little embarrassed here i think i think uh you know by looking uh his uh facial expression it's kind of got that i think he's he's mostly 
going to be disappointed. Yeah. And uh, the only way I, see this working. I don't Throw know. He's, uh, shovel, kill the he's a very good gamer, but he's not finding his rhythm here. And that's... Yeah, I mean, he's, that's important little, in all he's games. He's choking but... a little bit for sure. Yeah. Oh, do you I mean... do uh, like honestly? I mean, you nobody knows him better than you. I mean, I have a pretty good idea. I've I've known him more than half my life. But um, do you think he might? Do Do you think he might be throwing a little bit, or do you think this is actually just um he's just not feeling it? I you know I I don't think there is any intention of him wanting to throw right. at all. I think he is trying his best for sure. It's just I think it's choking. I think he thought I played oh, this God. game many times with Kate. I'm all sure I can just pick this up, you know, and then just get some pretty decent score. But what he didn't know is that yeah, I, perhaps it was I yeah. who carried him when we were playing co-op, and he just truly just realized that he That's maybe. Crazy. Not as good as what he thought. He was just so, along for the ride, yeah. I mean, that's... so what's what? What is the difference between uh, like co how does co-op function? Do you share hearts and money or like? No, so they have their individual hearts and everything. It's just um, the basic plays just like the solo. The only thing that's different yeah. is that at both characters. Um, they do not have their own sp uh, split screen. All so right. you do have Whoops. to be careful. Like if you were to be outside of the main screen, then you won't be able to see what's happening outside of that. So you, you guys, okay. you want to stay close. Um, but <laughs> everything else, it just plays just like the solo game. But The enemies don't like scale or anything? They well, do not they... scale. Yeah, they do not scale. Okay. Interesting. Ooh, <laughs> so, I mean, <laughs> they're just... Really Jump nice. from 1900 to 2300 spell. gold. Um, he's uh, there's no stopping him. Uh, I, I, you know, I'm a, I'm a doctor performing surgery. Uh, I got no heartbeat <laughs> left. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna call this time of death for Dan and and Rob. You know, <laughs> I, I, I really don't, I don't know that it's possible. They got less than 20 minutes. This is uh. But you know, kudos to uh, both Robert and Daniel, not giving up until until yep. the end. They're they're still trying their best, from what I can see, and uh, mm -hmm. even from Bear Taffy, I think he might even have a chance to beat his own high score here. Currently, his score is at two thousand three hundred thirty nine, um, and it's only bound to go up here. So I think so. He's on level. Uh, zone sorry, four, zone level one. Yes. Level one. And how many how many levels are there again? Three per zone. Three. Okay. So, so you're getting like, he's and he's got the the bosses he's gonna get. He's keeping his rhythm. I don't know if you can yeah. see actually bottom left. There is a potion. The potion that we know as one up. So if you can actually get there, and get that potion, it's gonna be a huge boost. He's gonna he's gonna have a chance. To actually get um, uh, more safety. So if I were him, I, maybe he did not see it on his screen. But if I were him, I would definitely go for that. That potion right there, right there, the orange potion. Mm -hmm. I think he sees it now. I think he's trying to get there, but oh, okay. a little bit scared. Trying to find the oh. the best way to get there. We'll see. Oh, he has he has the bomb. He has the bomb. He has enough bomb to access that potion. If I were him, I'll get their ASAP because anything yeah. anything can kill you, especially with only one HP here. Yeah. Well, mean in meanwhile, uh, Ryan I, looks like he's putting on his best showing. He's near 400 gold. Oh. I think, he's, I think you know, unbeknownst to him, he's kind of taking a page from Dan's book and just focusing on on killing. You know, I don't know if he's maybe just not buying a lot of items or, or anything i think he's just trying to play well and we all know from many episodes of isaac when it comes down to it he can play That's he can true. he can he can play games well you know i think he's he got a little too tied up in and trying to maybe find a certain meta or finding certain items and, and synergies and i think that that bit him in the butt a little bit i think he's just he's just him in the game right now he's just going in raw i uh 
And look at he's smiling on his face. He's feeling it. He's feeling it. <laughs> so Bear Taffy actually uh, died, but because thanks to that potion that acts as a one up, he consumed that potion. He now has three HP. But still, this run could go south anytime. The 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 zone the floor boss here is the red dragon. Red dragon being one of the hardest zone floor boss. All I mean the floor boss. And uh, Bear Taffy managed to kill it, no problem. He uh, look, made it look like child's play. That, uh, <laughs> I mean, you, you, if you hadn't told me that was uh, a boss, I, I would have just thought he was kind of a beefy minion. Just Bear going in, couple swipes, dead. I mean, he, he did spend about 400 gold to buy that meat. So if he if he didn't spend that money to buy that meat, he he might he's really close to his highest score, but he decided to play a little bit safe, spend that extra money, um, to get the the meat. To, you know, I think the meat recovers four full hearts. So okay. oh, the ballet shoes is really good. Oh, but I think the current shoes that he's wearing actually gives a defense boost. So maybe he doesn't want that. Kate, oh, you're gonna want to tune into Ryan. Oh, and never mind, he just died. Uh, 541 gold, though. 541 gold from Ryan. Yep. So that's, he is. That's higher than Team Team Dan here. Yep, he's comfortably. Uh, well, I don't want to say comfortably, but he is. He's definitely put himself a fair bit ahead of what Dan has achieved, and uh, I think I think Robert as well. So. But I mean, Dan's going. He's got one and a half hearts, 257 gold. I see he's got some rhythm going. Yeah, he hasn't. I think he actually. Oh, maybe we're a little too. <laughs> 267. Maybe we were a little too uh, early. I with... jinxed it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, no. He's. Uh... Ay ay ay! But bear is still going strong. Bear is still going real strong. Two thousand eight hundred sixty-four. Definitely a great chance. I mean, once he beat the boss, the boss itself, I believe, dropped like twelve hundred gold. So if he can manage to survive and actually just clear the game, just clearing the yeah. game will give you a whole bunch of extra gold. So yeah, I mean, he's about two hundred gold away. 250 gold from his his record today mm-hmm and uh, Looks like he's kind of on track to, to pass that, you know, unless something something happens, but I don't know I mean he seems to have it under control. He just got another heart going on there Ooh, 31 37 31 64, 64. 32 21. 9 now that's the high score that that's the high score. So we'll see if he spends oh. it. Do you think he's going to spend any money or probably just collecting at this point? I think he will probably save to assume that he will not spend money because he does have a consumable, the, the meat. Oh, but he actually went and bought the cookies. Wow. Mm, now that's a questionable move here. Now it went down to 30, 52. So yeah. No so wait, what are the, the cookies? Is that, is that just health? So I think per cookie uh, heals you a full heart, and there were a stack of six cookies, so that okay. was that was six full HP heals. So I guess I don't know if I were to spend money to buy the cookie, but I think he's he's trying to go for maybe not for the high score, but actually going for the the final boss kill. So maybe that's why he's he's going for. We'll see. Yeah, he's he's investing in his future, I guess. So. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm not, I'm not, uh, I'm certainly not in a position to, uh, to really question what he's doing. I guess if he feels Still comfortable five. with it and he's putting up these kind of numbers, then, you know. Ah, okay. So I, Bear Taffy actually has the DLC. So he is on the zone five. So that's the DLC amplified. So do we, how does that work with the others if they don't have the DLC? I did it. I actually did not know that Bear Taffy had the DLC. So did we just cap it at where he was? I think we should, although he did not fight the final. He had about 3,500. He did, he did not fight the final boss. And if, if he were to fight the final boss and kill it, 
that that would also give him a huge extra nice, coin beautiful. so it's kind of it's kind of a little iffy for sure but if let's let's just worry about it if anyone gets close to fair taffy's score okay but i'll, I'll now, tentatively just put down like he had 3500 about when he left mm -hmm. so we'll say so, for now 3500 for bear taffy yeah. and then yeah. if anyone gets close to the score then then we can work something out but yeah i think like i said team daniel with the minus 10 percent. i think uh let's just sit back and relax and enjoy the ride here that the the bear taffy is put in the wonderful show he's uh you know it's nice to have somebody of his, of his caliber here you know um you know no offense uh to the others but it's kind of nice to see past zone one <laughs> on, a, on a regular basis so thank you for that bear yes this is the first time that the bear has entered the zone five i believe that's uh but i mean it's... i you know all i can say is just thank you bear taffy for actually pressing on and instead of just showing us multiples like you said multiple zone ones yeah <laughs> over and over again you know it, it, it gives me uh gives my eyes a, a different color palette which they <laughs> certainly appreciate Whoa. uh i don't uh you know the uh, going back to it i'm a little i'm a little surprised at austin's showing you know um early on like he put up a score of i think 556 Wow. And um it's just been a kind of like a it looks like a decline since then. So I don't I don't know what's um going on there. I don't uh maybe don't, perhaps uh, tilted? Maybe he could be tilted. a little Yeah. A little tilted maybe he's here. trying to take some some heat off himself. A lot of people going into this have said um you know, they think mm, of the the team NL Austin's had a, a pretty big uh, and target on his back, I think. So mm -hmm. maybe Not this is cheese. you know you never know. This could be genuine, uh, just tilt and and uh, bad play. Maybe he's saying, you know what? Ah, it's best to lay low at this point. I don't know. Bear Taffy in a ooh sticky situation. He almost actually got killed, but. He managed to pull through. Maybe it was good, actually. Maybe a good idea to buy the cookie. He has consumed all the cookies, though. No more, no more consumables. No way to recover HP from Bear Taffy. But he does have three full hearts. I haven't really ever used the electricity very well, anyway. So I'm he's uh, chipping a chair. You know, he's still going. It's not over until uh, you see that uh, you died screen. So. Mm hmm. For now, I'll put Bear Taffy's high score as 3,500. Okay. So right as of right now, uh, it seems like Dan's high score is still 363. Um, I believe Ryan's highest is the more recent 541. And unless I'm mistaken, Austin's was 556. And we'll 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 see what uh, what Rob put up. Uh, unfortunately, it's a little hard to tell what he's he's working with here. Mm -hmm. I mean, Daniel, he's not giving up. He's still working really hard to manage to push through. But six minutes left on the screen. I mean, six would that minutes. be enough? Would that be enough for Team? Oh. That was unfortunate. He got killed by the slime in the first zone. <sighs> I think, uh, you know, he's, um, every death, uh, it kind of just, it pulls him out of it just that much more, you know? Once you, once you get off the track, it, it can be really hard to get back on, especially this late in the game. And you're thinking to yourself, I got five minutes. What can I do with five minutes? You said the world record speed run is about two minutes <laughs> that yeah it's about two but minutes. what kind of numbers are you putting up in that right obviously uh you're probably not getting as much you're definitely like they they know what they're doing they're not killing every monsters 
But I yeah. mean, they're the the tactics that you have to use for the speed running and the, for high score, they're both very different. But for high high score, I definitely think not losing the coin multiplier is very not like the number one. Then killing the shopkeeper from zone one, uh, floor one might be the best choice here, but. I, I believe we have not seen any players tonight that actually killed Shopkeeper. They, I know for sure that the Bear Taffy know about the, the Crown of Greed, but he, I think he's going for safe play. He knows that there is no other, any, any player even compete close to his level. So I think he's just going for, you know, safety. Why go mm -hmm. for any risky risk factor it, when no one is there to compete with you? So. Yeah, I can see why Bear Taffy is doing that, but I'm still really surprised that Bear Taffy. I mean, if I were him, I think after setting up the uh, 31 85 score, I think I'd have gone for the um, the Crown of Greed. I, I, you know, I'm I'm with you. Show off a little bit, you know. Yeah, you know, you, you 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 put up a good score. You can sit back, relax a little bit, which is obviously uh, going to be a huge factor in terms of performance, right? If you're all stressed and tense that you gotta get a certain score that's that's not helping you but if you know you set the bar that high that early i i think i agree i'd i'd probably have a little fun with it and see uh see what killing the shopkeeper could do mm -hmm. so currently bear taffy is fighting the final boss so now he has to get the final boss to hit the bell here oh it's a little tricky that's the only way to kill it. He killed the freaking boss. Oh, oh man, that was awesome. 57.93. Now this, and you thought that was the final boss. Nah, oh, nah, no, no, nah, you nah. lied. <laughs> the Necro Dancer. What is the what is the title of this game? Crypt of Necro Dancer. Now we're fighting the Necro Dancer. You thought the last boss was Necro Dancer. Now nah, that was actually Cadence's father. And now they have you have to control two characters at the same time to beat the Necro Dancer here. Oh my! So, which is which is quite tricky. So what they're doing right now is Bear Taffy has to control two characters at the same time, and they have two ah. wooden platforms on the, on the floor. They have to uh, place themselves so that they can press those wooden uh, buttons at the same time. Oh. While the monsters are coming to get you, and if any one of the player dies here, so uh, Bear Taffy controlling the Cadence's father and Cadence, um, if any of them dies, they actually it's a game over. Uh, okay. Wow. So, well, I, I, you know, it's uh, looks like it's a really, it's it's kind of like drumming in a way, right? You've got two arms, two legs. And they're all kind of doing their own thing at a time, at, you know, at, at a given moment, right? So Bear, mm -hmm. he's uh, he's controlling the two characters, and then he's also keeping an eye on the monsters, and he's got to see, okay, how do I move the characters to match these little button patterns? It's just, um, you know, that's some serious, serious multitasking. Yeah, and he's almost there to be able to attack the Necker Dancer here. There's a little tip, um, because Bear Taffy does not have the bomb, he cannot do it, but if you were to actually have bomb, instead of doing the floor, uh, the wooden panel puzzle, you can actually blow it up. Blow up the stage that the Necker Dancer was on and then just let him be on the ground and then you can just easily attack him and just kill it. And that's like one of the speed run strategy. Uh, mm -hmm. Instead of doing all the puzzles around. Oh, he's in the heat. He's in the heat. So, oh, the, the Cadence's father with one HP. Cadence with two HP. Bear Taffy using the shield spell to get some little bit of defense here. Bunch of enemies spawning left, right. Oh, Cadence's father actually died, and that actually ends the run here for Bear Taffy, and that actually finishes Bear Taffy's run here. So what? What? what we're we're got to be at the final countdown, right? We have one minute left, so... And Austin uh, just died. Uh, it looks oh like he's got 228. Um, looks like Ryan is uh, sitting back and uh, just chilling a little bit, I guess. Uh, Dan still, the, you know, the clock's ticking, but he's still playing, so props to him. 
I'm just gonna put two scores for bear taffy. 3,500 for um, before the floor or the zone five, and then the mm -hmm. final score being 5,793. Um, okay. Just because the the vanilla of the game does not include the extra zone, the zone five. So I'm just gonna keep that up there. But yep. I mean, if anyone gets even close to the score of 3,500, even then we do have to discuss further. But with the seven seconds left, I think I'm gonna give the boys a little warning. I'll be right back. Okie dokie. Daniel. Oh. Robert, thank you very yes. much. The time has top, uh, ticked down to zero. Please refrain from making any more progress. Thank you. Sure. Combat Tycoon Game Industries of Titan that I believe is coming out next. Hello, hello, hello. Hello. Uh, the timer has ticked zero seconds, so please refrain from making any progress here. I will put us all in the same room. Sounds good. Just be careful of Rob. He might be, uh, uh, I, don't, I don't know. <laughs> I just hope he's okay. <laughs> hugs, hugs. All right. I got to restart my stream. Something went wrong. Sitting still. Hey, hello, Rob. Hello, hello. Oh, hey. How's it going? <laughs> we were checking in on your stream. Yeah, how'd you, how'd you like it? Does it look I, good? It was incredibly cursed. <laughs> Do you, you see uh, all my great progress there? <laughs> the important thing is that the sponsor overlay is static, so that comes through really clean. Yeah, yeah. yeah exactly. That's perfect. Yeah. I think all 100 of your bits were to the to the sponsorship logo. So that's perfect. <laughs> oh, perfect. Yeah. Works for me. So here's the thing, Rob. Since uh, we couldn't actually see your score to keep track, you could just tell us any number and we'd have to believe yeah, you 6, that's true yeah but but i guys <laughs> i would never that. do that i mean my high score was just a measly ten thousand five. <laughs> oh my gosh you know, it, it's you know i wouldn't do that obviously yeah. unfortunately bear i got a score of 75 million trillion <laughs> uh, i like how well, i lied i didn't even i didn't even give myself the gold like i didn't even that's how much credit <laughs> I, 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 I didn't even lie for myself <laughs> So the result is out, and surprise, surprise, Team NL actually takes the win here. Oh shit! Team Team Bear, really? Team yeah, Bear. Yeah, team, <laughs> team Team Bear. I, I I saw the first boss once. once so Bear, Bear Ryan, are you happy with the highest score of five thousand seven hundred ninety-three? Congratulations! Thank you. Congrats, did you congrats. did you expect did you expect that you will get this high score or or are yes. you kind of disappointed that maybe it wasn't the score that you wanted maybe you wanted a higher score both are true actually i really wanted to beat the necro dancer right at the end there i would have been happy with myself if i had gotten the win but otherwise i'm okay oh all right all right so, so i actually, have a question for bear oh yeah yes sure. yes why didn't you kill the shopkeeper you coward yeah, you bitch. <laughs> I was begging Ryan not to the entire time. <laughs> he just kept missing on it. Did you? But Bear Taffy, you do know that when you do kill shopkeeper, the shopkeeper drops the item. The the crown right, of greed. yeah, the crown of greed. Yeah, I know that was. I mean, if we were better players, that would certainly be a viable strategy. But I don't. I don't really think that was. <laughs> I was trying, come on, I'm trying to include you now. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I don't know. I, I think I think we were probably better off playing without that consideration. So okay. if I hear that correctly, you thought we didn't need that to be Team Daniel. Oh, absolutely right? not. No. <laughs> <laughs> they almost didn't need me. <laughs> well, I mean, great, great job, both of both of teams. Um, we'll have quick three minute break. So if you have to use bathrooms or anything like that, please do so. Or if you like to sit here and chat, that's very welcome as well. Mm -hmm. So I'll, I'll see you guys in three minutes. Mm -hmm. I'll, yeah. take I'll, I'll take that bathroom break. I'll be right back. Hell yeah. Okay. You know, one of us has been uh, suspiciously quiet. Dan, uh, yeah. <clears throat> I have questions for Dan once he can uh, hear me. He was suspiciously quiet all all team game long as well. Actually, I was, yes, I was I was alone for the entire event. <laughs> so, you know, uh, so how you guys doing? 
Can't complain. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Feeling good. Yeah. 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 Nice. Yeah. Nice, nice. Um, do either of you know how to? Uh, nope. Set up human fall flat. Uh, lobby. Don't have a clue in the world, to be honest with you. Hmm. Hmm. I'm sure it's not too bad. Uh, yeah, I mean Josh can do it, right? Yeah, Josh. Well, can do that's it. yeah. <laughs> oh, I never mind. I it just needed to refresh. I think. Mm. Yo, what's the uh, best way to play this game? Mouse and keyboard or controller? Controller. Controller. Yeah, hundred percent. Mouse and keyboard. <laughs> <laughs> Is that really necessary, though, Ryan? <laughs> Come on now. <laughs> How uh how so who who's who's playing is it is it just everybody me? I believe yeah Ever, we're playing six handed yes. I believe so correct okay S with the collision winner. on the winner gets to choose who's on the block mm. so we're gonna be actively interfering with each <laughs> does other does the winner choose it? who's on the block or does the winner yeah. Oh, okay. And so oh, even even oh, an eliminated me. player. No, even in no, you get to. I think I, I get to I'm gonna win, well, and then well, I get to yes, choose but, whether so, Austin or Bear go on the block. Yeah, yeah. So I'm I'm on the block on like all, all automatically, but yeah, um, you can still choose between me and Bear. Yes, yeah, yes. yes, yes. So and then obviously, like if Bear wins, then you know I guess he could put himself on the block, but it's probably gonna <laughs> yeah, put yeah. Austin on the block or vice versa, but um. It's uh, this is where the social aspect comes in, boys. Mm -hmm. All Which... right, welcome back from the break. Uh, Hello. I, I will I will explain a little bit further of what uh, what we're expecting from the Human Fall Flat. So we're playing Human Fall Flat, and there is a mod called uh, the Leap of Faith, Part One. Hopefully, everyone <laughs> downloaded it and ready to go. Mm -hmm. So yep. whoever actually, so everyone competes, even Michael L. Fox, he will be competing here. <laughs> so I'll read out the rules. Whoever wins or goes highest gets to pick whether Bear or Austin go on the block. So currently, because Team Northern Lion is the winner from the last segment, that means I'll pick a patrol, he's on the block. And mm -hmm. from this game, the winner will be able to choose uh, whoever, uh, either Bear or Austin, will go on the block. And uh, whoever is the highest at the end of the timer wins or reaches the end. So either you reach the end or by the time that the timer runs out, whoever the highest will, will win this segment. Bear and Austin get a chance to make a plea to the winner beforehand. So you, you'll have some time, maybe maybe five to ten minutes to the, to the winner. Perhaps you are the winner, so you don't even need to plea. We'll see. And uh, please do not abuse the checkpoints. They do have checkpoints in this mod. And uh, if someone were to make further progress, just don't kill yourself so that you can just spawn on them and then throw them off. Just play um, as much as you can within the boundaries of salt and entertainment, not just the salt. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, Sounds good. But uh, I, quick I think, quick yeah. question. Mm -hmm. Um so with the with the checkpoints if someone does get a checkpoint uh when we die won't it automatically spawn us at the most recent or the the furthest That's checkpoint yeah, yeah, so yeah. You don't do it intentionally oh well yeah but oh, oh okay but but if if you die anyway and you get to the other checkpoint then what do we do do we do we walk back or no 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 it just it is what it is just play from there mm -hmm. but just okay. don't intentionally just die or yeah. maybe you just intentionally keep throwing so you could just keep people you know maybe you want to prevent someone to win or something like that so i think we can all like you know have our own sense of morality here you know for yeah. what's yeah. Uh, within yeah. the realm of acceptability yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. um, mm -hmm. I am missing a, a a Robert and a Dan. Oh my bad. Hold on. Let me... um, did you invite me? I didn't realize you said that. I did. Oh yeah, I'm also missing Bear. I'll send you another invite and Rob I got it, I got sent. It. Okay. Um. Also, one more question before we get in the thick of it. Um. How was the sandwich, Dan? <laughs> <laughs> what sandwich? I just want to know what you we're working with. Bologna, chicken, tuna. Mortadella, uh, a little, a little peanut butter. Oh, really? yeah. Yes, that's yeah. yeah. Did you think it would help you? Uh, no, I'm just hungry. 
Ah. You didn't Fair. eat before yeah. this? this is a pretty uh, big event. Didn't, didn't huh? install the game, didn't eat. <laughs> yeah, I do. yeah. That's uh oh captain, my captain. I don't know. It's 4D chess. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> now, now you're not the only one not in the game too, Dan. Well, so I have you just launched the workshop content. Is that what you do? Just accept the invite. Yeah. Okay. So I, I downloaded the I mean, I guess does everybody have to have the level? I don't I don't think so, but it I don't makes think it so. quicker. But, uh, I subscribe to it, so. So yeah. I have it here. I've got Austin, Ryan, Bear, Rob, and I sent Dan an invite, but I'll send another one just in case. I haven't played any of the custom levels on Human Fall Flat. I'm, I'm kind of excited about actually. All right. Yeah. I'm waiting to connect the server. Okay. So once, once everyone's ready, we'll, the host can start the game anytime. And this is going to be social aspect of the game. It's not just the gameplay here. So... If you do have to social engineer, <laughs> this is the game for you. So take take your chance. Hey Ryan, yeah, take my social box of friendship. <laughs> are you guys are you guys all spinning right now? It. We're waiting. I mean, on we're you. in the lobby. Yeah. Okay. Mine says connecting the server. Is that not the right thing? Uh, that's probably, probably right. Is. Yeah. Okay. Just let it go. Yeah. Let it go. Let it go. Turn away, close the door. Ooh, ah, ah, ah. <laughs> so Dan, how how did you like the game? Do you think you performed better than you thought, or yeah, like are you, you a little know, disappointed? My, my, no, my only experience was with um, uh, Cadence of Hyrule, and I really didn't get it. This was a lot of fun, and um, you know, probably after like the first thirty, like I got it, and it was really like uh, optimistic that. I mean, I don't know if I could get 5,000, but I think I could, you know. <laughs> it's a really fun game. And I, I think I, like, didn't give it a shot early on, but I really enjoyed it. It was cool. Mm. Are you, are you happy with your high score of uh, 300? It was 363. 363? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but, no, it was I, I was really happy. I thought, you know, um, there's a lot to learn, but I, it was like you can pick it up pretty quick. And I think the, the game mode you selected <laughs> I think was uh, you know really even the playing field as much as humanly possible. So it was come, cool. Mm -hmm. come, come grab this anvil, right there. This Wait, you guys are playing the anvil. The anvil, yeah, 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 yeah. You can uh, like hide oh, UI. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, oh this trick in the right book. <laughs> Everybody's in but you. <laughs> okay. Um, let me see here. Can you resend resend the invite? I guess, or do I just yeah, stay spinning? Yeah. Okay. Um, Wait, how awesome. do you raise your arms? Uh, left and right trigger, and you look up. Oh, right, 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 right. Okay, cool. Yeah, it's been a while. Robert, when, uh, you're going in this in a sticky oh. situation. You're, oh, Dan, are you joining in? Yeah, yeah. Oh, hey, Dan, let's go. All right. Uh, Should I hit start? Daniel, if you think you're ready, then then give us a sign. Okay, I'm re I think I'm ready. I, am I see him in the lobby with us. Yeah, so. let's go. All right, three, All right. two, one. Let the game Good start. Luck. <laughs> all right, Good luck, everybody. All right, all right, all right. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. I hope you guys enjoy my perspective of the view. Um, <laughs> it's gonna be good, good luck for maximum chaos. Let me win. Are you guys split screened? No. Oh, no. it's laggy with the oh playing on mouse and that's gonna be. Oh so yeah. Bad. Is there some latency? <laughs> oh frig off. <laughs> no, that's that's a. All right, I'm gonna move into the jury room and I'm gonna turn on the sound. There's a bunch of latency. Is that on what? Yeah, it works for, for me. I don't have any. I mean, I've got a lot, but I mean, you, you know what my situation is. Yeah. <laughs> well, all right, I'll get used to it, I guess. I'll, uh, I I'll think gladly uh, relinquish hosting to... Uh, Dan has two characters? What's Kate? happening here? Or anybody I else? Mean, uh, I, can, I can host it if you guys want. I'm uh, only doing this because I was, I was told oh, to host it. <laughs> What's Dan doing here? Dan has a co-op player of him, uh, himself yeah, in the game? Used to it. Oh, shit. Oh, that's all the way back, huh? Oh. <laughs> could Dan, could you just someone there? tell? No, I got two players. I'm on split <laughs> screen, but I'm all good. What? I have two <gasps> players. It's all good. It's we just we just go we we roll. Oh, with it. okay. Now hey, to hey, spend hey, the next hey. hour. Neither of us win if that happens. Spend the next hour just blocking people from making this jump. <laughs> I mean. I, oh, I never realized it was funny. this hard to set up. So yeah. you guys play this a lot on the NLSS, right? Or a different oh, version of it? Oh, Human Fall Flat Lobby. 
Yeah, it's this, no. but we play, oh. like, custom levels. So, basically this. And there's, like, a goal to get to the end? So, I think, actually, Ryan is yeah. making yeah. It's a cooperative, usually. huge uh. progress ahead of everyone. Well, yeah. <laughs> no, no one else is actually fighting. I missed. Yeah. Oh, that jump is tough, dude. Man, I can't wait to watch the VOD of this one. On the screen. I have no idea what this looks like. Okay. <laughs> okay. Who's the cop? Rob? Me? No! Oh. <laughs> okay. I almost did it. How did you get that ring? What is this lag? It was easy. Is it like unplayable? Should we restart? No, it's fine. I just, I'm just getting so annoyed because I was just doing this so fine earlier today. I mean, yeah. Early if we need today. to to sort something out, I'm I'm down. Especially now that I know how to host or. I, I will. I will else. let you know if it becomes a problem. But for now, it is tolerable. I think. Is there you anyone going? ahead of? I, I, it's a tough one, man. I'm going. Daniel, could no, not... I went. Oh, <laughs> you have to let go. Of it. I got it. You, you can let go. Daniel, oh, no. No. oh God, why? Oh, Whoa. Oh, okay. okay, we'll you pretend cheaters, we got it. You cheaters. You cheaters. Uh, Daniel still can't get past me, the right. first, <laughs> first yeah, obstacle no. here. <laughs> Yo, for the, those of us that have never seen this game before, can anyone give us a first grade uh, explanation of, of how you play it? You want to climb to get no. the checkpoints. Okay. Ryan. What? He's Rob, ahead. you're a cop, right? I mean... Yeah, I'm a cop. Okay. I'm not going to hurt you. No! <laughs> it's a little slit. Oh. Uh, well, oh. sorry. I guess I'm no! Up Use here. the camera. Okay. Dan still cannot make it up to the first obstacle here. No. No. Okay. There we go. Okay. Oh, God. That's going to be awful with the lag shit. Yeah. Okay. Let me up. Ryan making huge Please. progress. Oh. It's insane. It's how fast he oh, can sorry. go. Oh. oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. How? In the. Did you get a head bear? No, I fell off because I'm mad. <laughs> Did Daniel. Here. Can we yeah, can we you see guys, you uh, free Robert, chance. is the bit rate any better here? Okay, up we go. <laughs> Am I missing something? <laughs> Almost. No! Okay, that's way tougher than it looked. It is a work of an art. <laughs> Wait, where's Mouth? I'm back at the tree. I, I don't know how you... Did you climb the tree? I went around the tree. Echolocation. I think I didn't find the tree, but I went around. It's like it. an echolocation. You can like kind of shimmy around it, just barely. And then, barely. When, and then what though? There's no. Dan cannot the make it over no the ring. first the obstacle. Gone. Oh my god, the ring's gone. Okay, you can jump off then. That, I think that's fair. Okay. I, yeah, I didn't want to wanna jump because I I saw Ryan on the ring earlier. Yeah, yeah, you're good. Oh, there was a thing. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna. I was wondering about that myself. Okay. Well. Wait. Careful, Ryan. This one's tough. <laughs> ah, get a let go of me. Who is this Get off. Guy? Okay, I see what you got. Get off me, Valve. I'm busy here, man. It's what you let get. Go. Let go. Let go. You've, you're you've a naughty boy. You've you done are. this to yourself. But, you need Ryan, more. we're going too fast. <laughs> no, no. Go. Not true. Fine. Not true. God damn it. You want this? I want it all. What's down here? <laughs> no. Yeah, baby. Mouth fighting bear taffy here. If we can, let's oh, tune well, in to back, Mal's perspective oh, here. Dude, the next part's really hard. Hey, God. let go. Mouth. Oh, this Get is you. Me. I thought I thought you were Dan. No, how let wait, go. How do I know it's not Dan? Oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I think not, we can be clear it's not Dan. <laughs> Yeah. Dan, are you using, are you using <laughs> controller or mouse and Is there a way to? Yeah. Is there? There's a way to pull yourself up, right? So look. Jump. God damn it! Get your arms yeah, up by looking up and then pressing the triggers. Yeah. Now then bring yeah. in the salt. Jump and grab something and then move your look down like you're doing a pull up. Yeah, just like that, Dan. God damn it! Are you on the wheel of death yet, Bear? No. Oh, I got there once, but I can't oh. go back because I I keep mistiming shit because I think I'm. 
gonna hit the button right away, but I don't. Mouth actually distracting like that, Daniel. It's hard. It's really hard even with that light. But Daniel is not saying anything. <laughs> God. I got it. I got it. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. There we go. Darren, are you going to come up here with us yet? <laughs> God, no. So, yeah, someone's pulling me. God, I don't know who it is. Damn it. <laughs> mouth. God. Oh, my God. Ryan! <laughs> You had your chance. Malv, are you trying to like show you're... me how to get up there? Or what are you doing? Uh, yeah, I'm just trying to help you, but you're fighting me a little <laughs> bit here. All right. All right. So you said use the camera, Ryan? There we go. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> so like the standard is like hit both triggers. Uh huh. Look up. Your arms will go up. Then jump and grab onto something while keeping the triggers held. Got gotcha. you. Then gotcha. look down. Then look down and, then... and pull yourself up. <laughs> End me. Down to pull up. Oh, God. Ryan actually stuck. I'm a flag. Oh, my God, yes. Uh... Mouth making progress to catch up to everyone. Wait, Bear, did you do it? Yes. Fuck. <laughs> Who is this? Who is that? <laughs> Ryan, dude, it's, it's, it's not as easy as you would think. Once Let go, try again. Absolutely not. Oh. I think Dan's pooping the PB and J. How yeah, yeah. like yeah. yeah. I go. know what my we arms first do. First platform. I. Mm. All right. He has made it onto the first platform. <laughs> <laughs> I'm yes. No, please. Right. I'm gonna so make it no, easier. Yeah. I've <laughs> made it up to the first platform. Dude, oh, I have had I'm one it, fucking shot. It easier. <laughs> don't worry. Oh. Just don't touch them. Just stop. Just stop touching them. There, there, there. It's done. Why, Dan? <laughs> That's not me. I'm at the beginning. Uh, I've had one <laughs> shot, and you just took the box out from me. I was making it easier, and then Dan took the box out for me. Uh, Austin, I am. On, I haven't even gotten the first pedestal. That's where I am. <laughs> well, then not who me. is this? Not me. It's probably Malf. Malf. I mean, I have a skin. Yeah, Malf has a skin. It's you, Dan. No, I, I guarantee there are it's two, not me. There are two playing characters down here. Yeah, randoms from Malf's friends list. Wait, it's is it Bear? <laughs> no, I'm not down there anymore. Bear's Jesse. Wait, do you Dan, I'm actually trying we to have an intruder. That's how pathetic. We have is. an intruder in our game. I can get up there. No problem. You can. Who the fuck is ball guy, dude? There's a, there's, I believe, a, a, a hack. <clears throat> oh, is no. Is there a way to tell? How do you, how? The, how did you do that? Bear? Ball guy? I Who's that guy? Checkpoint. I want to know how you did that. I'll go back. I will. I'm pissed. I can't. I can't even go back. Wait, how'd you? I can't even go back. There we go. There it is. Someone feel free to make that bridge. I'll do it. I feel like I owe it. To ball guy? No, to to bear for using his hey, checkpoint. There you go. Sir. Appreciate it. I think Malf can kick that player uh, yeah. by pressing Y. Is he still over there? Let's go. He's still there. Oh, you, you cheeky son of a bitch. I thought we were working together for a second. Oh, oh you... is Ball Guy Dan too? I have a split yeah, screen. He does have two, right? But I, I'm only controlling the one on the pedestal. Because, uh, yeah, I tried to, to yeet him, but I couldn't. You want me to, you want me to push oh, yeah, this no, to the it, side? It is yeah, just I someone mean, in this I chat. I don't know how to do this very reliably. Can... Go for it. Let's see. Just push Ball Guy out. <laughs> All right, well, close. Yeah. Be a good way to do it. Oh, oh no. Yeah, it's over there now, though. Oh, I guess I have it. Hey, Mal, I think the intruder ball guy, guy should leave. Hmm. I don't know. Not sure. Oh, oh he here. left. Having he left. Little, uh, ball guy, ball guy got ejected. Out. How the fuck are you doing that? <laughs> Just hold X. <laughs> <laughs> mm. <laughs> 
Get up, out, Mal. That's yeah, wonderful. This is how I spend most nights, honestly. Oh, hell yeah. Look at it. Oh, man. Oh, no. I'm there we falling. go, dude. <laughs> Oh, dude, there's like a actually. Hold on, there's a there's a butt dance you could do if you. Oh, yeah, yeah. Maybe yeah. just hold on. Let me see if I can do it. <laughs> oh. All right, All mouth right, is uh, just taking too long. <laughs> I mean, you can try and help me because I can't. I'm coming uh, to help. You gotta leverage. Leverage. I, I know what leverage out. is. Let, let go of the board. <laughs> let go of the board, mouth. Okay, okay. I'll let go of the board, and then you let go of me. <laughs> Slow them down. Slow them down. Mouth. I did it while you were grabbing my ass. You, you, th you do it by yourself, and then you can, <laughs> you can. Oh uh, shit! Oh no, dude! Come on, we need it though. Oh. I didn't mean to do that. Uh, let's go. Oh. Here, I, I'll do it again. I have full faith. My guy's just like it. Desolate. Wow. So I believe they're oh, Kathy, yeah. Dumb Dog, Michael L. Fox. Gravity. They're oh, all in the oh, same yeah, yeah, you guys got it. area. Oh, including so, a pocket patrol as so well. Hard to pull away, though, and it's I'm <laughs> pushing. You gotta put. You gotta push This up is the place where pushing, people need to co-op. I'm not pulling. Yeah, I'm yeah, not pulling. I'm. I'm. I'm literally not pulling. You're my pulling. <laughs> I like here. Look at my camera. Look at where my thumbs are. They're not on the freaking sticks, brah. I got it. I fucking nice. got it. Come Hell on, yeah. he's gonna take it. He's gonna take it. No, 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 no. We, I can't let him. I can't let him have it. I no, can't let him have it. Give it. Give it. Give it. Give it. No, 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 he can't have it. He can't have it. He can't have it. Not when he's alone up there. Mouth's turning off the the salt here. Sprinkled as salt. He's gotta wait for us to cross, and then he can have it. All right, fine. Oh, Austin just got eaten off. <laughs> Alright, Rob, 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 get ready. Let's go. Go, go, Rob, Rob, Rob. Let's go. Let's go. I have a question for you guys. At the second lantern, what are you supposed to do? <laughs> Swing on it. Swing around. Yeah, it, Swing it, around go around the corner, and there's a little bridge on the edge of the. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah, I don't know Thank about you. that one. <laughs> okay, here we go. Let's try one more time. Ryan's cheat. Oh yeah, welcome Ooh. back to the pond, bud. <laughs> Send him out. It's for honored purposes. I, I will sit still for the next one minute. No, I'm just gonna spank you. Well, you're you, just gonna be watching us struggle with this piece of wood for a minute. Yeah, then. this is tough. You cannot knock but, me Oh, off. I think Ryan has made it on to, to the checkpoint as well. I think, uh, Dan, oh, Dan Giesling, I think it has also fallen down from the sky. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. Okay, okay you got it. You hey, Ryan, how many, uh, how many gift subs are you giving me to let you go? Mm, zero. Oh, right. Dan Giesley, victory, no victory. one notices that Dan right, Giesley is here. Slowly grab it. Yep. Yeah. He's I he's believe. silent. He's trying to blend passes. in. He's skipping half of the level. Wait, wait. We Get said gentlemen's Austin. agreement not to do that. Grab it. But he's Got keeping well. he's, yeah, he's yeah, keeping yeah. his mouth yeah. shut. Go, right, no right, one right. notices. Daniel being on there. Over. Just push it and flip it. I, I'm gonna let go. I'm gonna let go. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Got it. I have 15 seconds left. All right, uh, I'm gonna give it to you, Austin. Okay. Oh, Daniel actually. The rule is like, if you don't spawn there, you can't get there, right? So I gotta get there. No, you, I, I spawned with you guys, so I'm tr I'm trying to go back across? to where I spawned. No, but you it's might close. Almost. It's close. You're gonna five gift off, subs will do it. That's try right. try to put it down. Oh <laughs> no! Damn it. Hey Ryan. That's no, right. <laughs> Wait, uh, let go. Mouth trying to, to stir up claim. Ryan here. Oops. Oops. <laughs> no, no, you Dan, can take your point, you Dan. Keep going. We were yeah. just talking about it. Like it's it's unfortunate that it loads you there, but it's un it's unfixable, oh, okay. so you can just I got keep you. going. All right. Yeah, you're good, dude. This I mean, we so we have awkward. to be cooperative right now in order yeah, to. Yeah. After the, I'm looking ahead. After this part, it's all jumps. Yeah. Mouth, you aren't helping. Yeah, I got the one in. I'm keeping it. I told you, he pulls, dude. He's I'm trying not to sabotage. pulling. Here, my hands are out, so if right, somebody wait, grabs it's good. it, it, it I somebody, no, it's not good. It's not good. Uh, no shame in the game. When I'm okay. screwing you over, that is not me pulling. Ryan's trying to make it onto the other platform. Like my right. hands are out. All you have to do is get it onto my hands, and then whoever's up here with me can pull me up. Uh, okay. There I tried you to greet it. You it's can just you can grab my head and pull me up, too. You uh, gotta turn yeah, turn the damn ah uh, there we go and then here do I got gotcha? you dude we're there is it I'm there pushing it I'm pushing oh. it on it oh I don't think Robert so. trying to I save it. It. Oh, Ryan there we go incredible work I'll pass it on you go on ahead 
Okay, okay. Hold it, hold grab the around. board, grab the board, dude. Hold it. I, I, I can't because Ryan had to come up. We're good now, though. Did He's Ryan have to his hands up? out. <laughs> he made it. He made it seem like he did. Nah, let's try to Rob, stir just go up for it, dude. Progress. the pot. <laughs> Maybe the board. he's helping. Yeah, yeah we need the, the board. board. Stop humping the lasers. Stop humping and grab the board, damn it! It's not close enough. <laughs> try to try to X grab. I got a weird. Mouth, I got a weird angle. It's hard for me to tell how close it is. <laughs> mouth. Look up. Look up. All right. Ooh, 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 we're getting close to his hands. Oh, so close! He's got it. He's got it. Okay. Okay. Nice. Okay. okay, now just lay it flat okay. on there. There you go. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Get up. All right, Rob. Yeah, yeah, pull it up. Stay let's still, go. Just stay still. Just stay okay, still. We let gotta them go. Run. Yeah, let them let them come up. Ryan's <laughs> stuck underneath the plank. Get up. Get up. No. Okay, throw, yeah. throw, 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 I'm not trying to take a board. Pull me up. Mal, let go. <laughs> I'm not letting go. You let go. Let go, Mal. I, I got you. You can pull me up. Take the board. Take it. I got it. Okay, 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 okay. All right. okay. All right, hold on. Let me get on the other side. Let me get on the other side so I don't uh, knock off. We gotta grab. We gotta, we gotta grab the like the, this 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 edge trick right here and then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, the board is falling. Oh, oh, oh Ryan actually pushed oh, that so easily so off. Oh, oh I got it. he's done it. No, you son of a bitch. Yo, can you guys bring the board back? Someone push me off. No. Let's go! Oh, no. yes. Pull it, pull it, pull it, pull it, pull it, pull it. Dude, we um, don't need them. The, the, the issue is that it's a checkpoint anyway, so. Yeah. Oh, right. oh yeah, but they gotta earn it. Honestly, I earned it, like, you took it we away. all, we all in, in, were involved in okay, that now pull the, You gotta pull the lever. Yeah, yeah this one's fun. <laughs> oh, wait, yeah, with, mul with multiple people, I guess you can't really you oh, know, yeah, you gonna worry about the silly thing. Are you gonna do it? Yeah, we're gonna have to wait for him to open this door for us. Well, he's, I, he's gotta push the button. He's not going to. Through, so. I'm well, gonna he... open the door because I have to push the button. This is too many people on one lift. Hey, I pulled the lever for Austin. So the door's was... open. You gotta oh. hit the button over there to get the elevator to drop. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I know. No. I know. Everyone's fighting. Everyone's fighting. Do <laughs> I want to. Someone's gotta hit the button. Go get the Hold button. On. Yeah, but I don't want to hit the button. Hit Somebody, the button. Dra we, gotta, we gotta drag this cable too, probably. I don't want to hit the button because <laughs> then they're just gonna take the elevator up. I need assurance you that enough, you're. You have enough time to get down. I mean, we've all been pretty. You know. You got plenty of time to get down. I promise you. Just hit the button. Somebody need this cable? Get out of my way, please. We gotta go. <laughs> oh, my legs. My the legs. No, you're, the my legs. you're gonna need. You're gonna need the wire anyway. You're gonna need. With the half the screen anyway. because I've got the wire on me right now. Jesse Pinkman. Is that bear? He no! has player one and uh, player yeah, two. Yo. I'm that's, just trying to hold on. That's on his own hand. I don't want to get he did off. that to himself. All right, going up, boys. Oh, oh, you're going into. Hold on, hold on. You guys need this wire, don't yeah, you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you don't, don't need the I wire. I don't think you need the wire. You don't need it. I, I think the, it's got too many people. It's way down. <laughs> we can't take this many people. Oh, really? <laughs> oh well, I mean. Right, I'll, I'll volunteer to get off. He's insane. We're He's trying to We're going to get up there eventually, boys. He's hey, you son of a bitch. <laughs> You think the wire is maybe stuck? You know what I'm no, saying? No, it could be all, all the way up here? Get this dumb shit off there. We ate one too many They're sandwiches. They're happy actually and sacrificing <laughs> his chance to win. I mean, maybe it's that going. will work for his. No, no, I'm not pushing. I'm not pushing. I'm just ben, holding it. Maybe not. <laughs> okay, I mean, okay. I mean, if he wins, then he doesn't have to be on the block. But he's right, I'm holding on trying to. to be the nice guy here. <laughs> Let go. Let go. <laughs> I will not. Everyone's holding. I know, but I'm gonna jump, and if I you're onto me, it's not gonna work. All right, fair enough. You put your arms up in the air, and then you can jump too. Ryan! Yeah, that's why I'm not doing Ryan! that. Ryan! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Go, go, go! Mouth actually making Mouth actually making a head. Mouth actually making a head. Try to make up. <laughs> Everyone's trying to weigh Ryan down. Hit the button. <laughs> there you go. Hey, Barry, yeah, you can hop on. Yeah, now. Barry. Oh, yeah. Yeah. At least oh, use so your nice. use your other hand to climb. Look at, look at these idiots. No, hey, don't hey, go, hey, let's go. Hey, hey, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Mouth that's cannot me, make it onto the platform. Okay, right. That's me. I let go, to, I let so go close. <laughs> I'm going to wait Ooh, my turn. Oh, Austin actually making a hit. See ya. See you as well. Uh, I'm just kidding. Uh, I'm not I will also see you. Austin and, and Ryan making Peace. a hit. I'm out. Uh, get up. Get up, buddy. Let go of me, Mouth. God damn it. I needed you. <laughs> What the fuck do you do Both here? Both very close. 
Oh God. I'll Robert go actually. No, 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 bear. Here, grab my legs. Grab my on legs. the third yeah. here. Austin bear, number bear, one. Bear. Uh, NL so. being second place. Robert on the third yeah. place here. Do not, feel, okay. do not feel sorry. Oh wait, I remember this oh. shit. Yeah, this looks familiar. Yeah, we did this map. Here. I forgot. We've done this one. <laughs> pull up, pull up, pull up. Here, I get you. I'll get you, buddy. The lamp does not. And if I remember hurt. this map, there's a door of, of <laughs> Satan up ahead. So I'm gonna let go of my left hand arm, bear. Oh, all right. Hold on, hold oh, on. The, yeah, maybe the lamp is coming go, back. This is a very precarious situation. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you want to win? Right. Is that what you're trying I to got do? You. All right. Uh, Mouth grabbing wait, Ryan. Look up. Yo, Ryan you grabbed you the lamp. Mouth actually could not grab onto the lamp here. Come on. No. Let's go. No. 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 I can see oh, Bear, Robert. Bear's oh, out here he earning some votes right now. That's, you mm -hmm. know, mm -hmm. it's not about Ryan how fast you get to the, top. On to the platform. It's what you do along the way. Um, right. can someone? Okay, I think we're good. Never mind. No, give me a shit break. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you had one a little while ago. <laughs> That's true. Yeah, I have the opportunity anytime I want it, really. Austin's still right. ahead. How do I call the elevator back down? Yeah, Rob, uh, we got to do this together, brother. Oh Lord! All Ryan right. catching up to Austin right. very quickly. Right, but you can't go without me <laughs> because. Oh fuck! Okay, I can do this. This one's not too bad. I think right behind them is Bear Taffy. Oh! Ryan. All right. They're both hanging on for dear it's lives, but they cannot make it up. <gasps> if you get up, you gotta pull me up. Ryan. Absolutely, it's oh. Team NL. <clears throat> Ryan's hey, there's no teams in this one. Okay, hold on. Keep doing that. No, keep doing that. Yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna move my left arm. Okay. I'll okay. do that one again. Okay. Hold get on. you, get you. It's, you pull it's it up. Gonna take a yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Now, now, now don't oh, let go. Maybe, no, no, no. Okay, maybe I gotta do one big swing. Yeah. Oh, hold on. I gotta get the momentum going. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> one, two. Please, hey guys. Hello, uh, hello, so fellow so Team so NL member. Oh, I'm so sorry. I wasn't trying to grab you. <laughs> Here, because I am a, such a oh, team player. Oh, they're both so close, but they cannot get on the platform. Oh, oh, thank you. Oh, hey, somebody else is here, too. Yo, what's up? Oh, Robert, you oh, oh okay. Wait, is Dan there? Yeah, Dan's here. Okay, well, good luck. Austin, please move your head, <laughs> and then I'll jump off your head to get up. I'm going to swing. Look at this momentum. Look at this crazy this, this momentum. This could work, too. This could work. Are you keep... trying to use the momentum to jump okay. onto the platform? We gotta get me around the other now way. Now I'm actually catching up or, to them. Or, you know what? Crazy idea. If I can get back. Bear Taffy just wa waiting on the swing for both of them to actually clear the path. Quick. I almost got it. I can't stop you. I got it! Okay. Now I got this thing. Bear Taffy okay. made it helps. onto the platform. We're really screwing over the other team, which is nice. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Dan, get on the platform. Hey, I just want to let Ryan, you guys know I, have to I go. am thank not you, on a you. team anymore. Oh, frick. Ryan. Oh, okay, I reset abandoned. actually. Abandoned. Wait, better. Did you go on ahead? Mm -hmm. Oh, hold abandoned. On. Oh shit. I was asleep. NL. <clears throat> Come on on. Hello, boys. How's it going, Dan? Good. Robert, Mouth, Dan, both on this elevator. Oh, oh. It, it's you. Yes. Austin. Woo, let's go. I got you. Saves right. Ryan. My life is in your hands, dude. It would be so funny if you drop me right now. Oh, lag. Oh, you gotta pull, yeah, pull, pull yourself lagging. up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay, Austin, okay. did not <laughs> betray. Oh, God, now I'm getting that delay that, that Bear was talking about. That oh, NL it's got gave it to way him. worse all of a sudden. Oh, shit. I mm. might want to stand still until this evens out. Who the fuck is Team this Unity. person, dude? Dude, there's a random person in this lobby. Oh, yeah, people are just joining. Mm. And it's causing it to lag. Shit. Did you set it to a closed lobby move? I don't know. I mean, I probably didn't by the looks of it, but this is my first time setting up a lobby, so yeah, uh, that is my bad. I kicked them, I think. Uh, Kick them again. It's still here. Go. Kicking player. Rocket Buzzuts kicked. He's God, kicked. He, he disappeared. We go. Got kicked. <gasps> Ooh, Ryan, place. make a huge leap. Yeah. All right, now it's just us. 
Team NL oh, making hey, a huge place, lead guys. here. Hello, where's the chain thing? How does this work? You guys, you removed the chain? I think it's possible that the chain was removed. Did it happen again? Oh, yeah, shit. there's no, uh, there's no, uh, lantern. I think. Oh, is there no? Oh. <laughs> Well, I mean, yeah, you can definitely not make. Oh, I see the lantern. Yeah, it went around. <laughs> oh, but it br it brought us up here, so it's all good. Yeah. Team Dan Giesling all right, all right. using the checkpoint scum. They they're here. Oh, we need the on. leverage again. Oh, Josh did this the last time. I don't remember how he did it. This oh, is... Josh is like a fucking monkey in this game, dude. This is he's. he's so a... oh, you no. can. You can do so you if you do like one handed swings, you can get vertical height. It's it's hard, but you can do it. Actually, hold on. I, I think I know how you how you can do this. Hold on. Wait, where's Bear? Don't worry about it. Bear. Where are you? Don't worry about it. Hmm. <gasps> Is Bear Taffy? Oh, ahead, there's like a little monkey bar thing going on, huh? Okay. No! No! Uh, oh, Kathy, Bear Taffy so close to the end! I'm grabbing my shirt, I can't help you. <gasps> He's almost there! He's the nice guy, he played the nice guy on the elevator. He is almost at the end! Wait. Bear Taffy oh, might be the I strongest mean, I even, player. I don't, I don't even know how you in this you competition. Things, uh, you're gonna like. He doesn't you, even need to play to dirty like a to win. Did swing and then you gain some like. Ooh, momentum. very close. Bear's doing some wacky stuff. I don't know where he is. I'm back. Where were you? <laughs> I was getting worried. I was like, what's he doing? Oh, someone else is onto things. Yeah. It was so no, you close. Not, you will not do this alone. They are tapping. No. Oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> They're trying to cheat the system. Just trying to go around the game instead of doing the official way. Mouth, on the other hand, trying to do the things on the so official I way. Hey, you're not supposed to do that till after the show. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, Francis! You will not. Mouth was so close, but he, he dropped down, unfortunately. Let's see if Ryan actually <laughs> figured the secret out Excuse here. Sir. Nope. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. Nope. He's you're, on you're, the wall you're here. Need to give me some of Pardon me, I'm gonna need you to. You're move. gonna need to. <laughs> Oh, uh, hi guys. Yeah, you're all, uh, hey, all over here, huh? Everyone dangling that, uh, on the wall. Here? Turn me around. <laughs> nah. <laughs> it appears we have a symbiotic relationship. Uh huh. <laughs> I think Ryan hanging on to Bear mm. Taffy here. I'm gonna need you to let go. Mm, that will not happen. <laughs> but if you grab over there and then pull me up. Oh uh, no! <laughs> what is Oz, what is not... Ryan grabbing? No, no don't. What is Ryan grabbing on their taffy? Think about the future. It's that doesn't look like it. a leg to me. Fine, Fine God damn it. Little brothers nice in chat, try. please. Get, you can't grab me the whole damn time. <laughs> Oh, I got your head. I got your head. That, that, one, that one's on me. That one's on me. Yes. How did you guys Ooh, go around? Ryan actually making a head here. Through the here. power of friendship. Yep. A little oh, bit. like a chain? Mouth. Trying oh, to somehow. make... Trying to do the things correctly, being but that only puts him oh, God. way oh, behind. So far yeah, back. it does. It does. Bear, I'm gonna need you to, to miss this. Yeah. There we go. Let's see the bear Taffy's perspective here. Oh, He's on the swing. I just got to, to fall in. Mm -hmm. nah. oh. Oh, 
air. This is hard, dude. Ooh, one hand you swing. You only have one hand. Yeah, you're in a bad spot. No, I mean, I'm doing that on purpose, actually. No. Oh. Um. How am I gonna do this? I don't know. Oh, but... Rob's back. No. Yeah, welcome back. <laughs> All right, let's see. There, Taffy, trying to make it onto the next swing. Could you roll things? No way. Oh! Oh! oh he, that? dude. That was very close. He, he makes it onto the second swing I'm, here. I'm exploring. Okay. Yeah, you can kind of get to it this way, can't you? This is gonna. Be oh, a they're tangled. Not oh, oh, wait, wait, wait! Austin is holding on the second bar. They're both on the second bar. <laughs> We're in this together, I but. Yes, yeah, go for it then. Oh, I almost had it. How am I not grabbing it? I'm hitting it. I know. Oh, I got it. I got it. Oh, they're both. They both got on the third. They the both got onto the third there, swing. So you don't. Just grab the bottom. Austin and Bear, Austin and Bear, they're all, they, they, they are the contestants <laughs> to be on the block and Austin just dropped down! No! Oh, no! Oh, no! Bear Taffy just kind of butter fingered. All he needed to do was just grab onto the wheel, but he actually let go! Ah, uh, it's never gonna work. Ooh, how much time do we have? I think like I think it's over. It Wait, close. Well, we're, we embarrass we Titan. Delayed. We are at the same obstacle. No, I got the furthest. I I, no. I got onto the obstacle. Austin. They have I twenty three minutes, but I believe Bear Taffy is just saying the time That's is true. over, just to make He's people's little panic here. You gotta go fast, like Sonic. Oh, Ryan's ahead. Uh oh. It only matters when the time that. hits zero. The person who is standing the furthest, so that's the only that matters. It's not the person Wait, no, who I made just, the, I, the, I the furthest progression. You're going too fast. It's when the timer <laughs> hits zero. The person standing the, the highest, the furthest in the you know course do, wins. Actually? Hold on. Do you mind backing up a touch? Ryan no, is at the third at swing the trying to grab onto the spinning wheel ordained, here. My guess, God. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I appreciate y'all still trying to. Oh, you completely. <gasps> oh! I, I'm not intentional. Oh, hey guys. Hey. That you made was it, Robert. So oh close. no. Oh, I'm just, I'm just on swinging part, like these boys. <laughs> Sir, please just unhand me. Sir. Oh, that's not good. That's yeah, a problem. Fuck. Eat it, eat it. <laughs> I won't. Oh, Man, right. little Very brothers violent. in chat, please. Oh, uh, you lost know. one. Good luck, Bear. Who's over here on Swing Swing Town with me? Who's this? Me. Oh, hey. I think I'll right, I'm going to try to do it the legit way on one time here. since I'm technically ahead now. It's uh <laughs> it's weird. That's out of my that's out of my jump range. It's hard, man. This part right here is tough. Yeah. I think it might be easier if you go like monkey bar strats. I think that's what you're supposed to do. Yeah. Yes. Okay. We have another shot at it, boys. Austin moving on, trying to make it onto the wheel. They still do have 22 I minutes. Myself anymore. No, no. Ooh. 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 That was the scariest thing in my entire that life. That was very scary. I gotta go for it. First lamp. Oh, that was terrible. Let's try again. Oh no! The swing, the third swing is stuck. Uh, when 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 are they gonna call time? I'm ready for them to call time. And shut up. Uh, like 20 minutes. Oh, the third okay. swing oh, is stuck. We got Saying there's time. a chance. <laughs> Bear, what's the mark hit marker you got to? I got to the last spinner up they there. They might actually the have to restart this map. The, uh, in that case. Last set of monkey bars. So it's okay. Ways. It's basically the second to last obstacle, I think. How do you do this? The monkey bars are fucking hard, man. No. Oh, oh. <laughs> I got it. Oh yes, okay. No, one of the monkey bars <laughs> is stuck. <laughs> no, I can only just yeah. that. <laughs> we'll have to reload the checkpoint. Hold on, let me give me one shot here. 
You can make a human bridge. <gasps> Ryan. Ryan grabbing on Dawson. Ryan. By utilizing the power of our combined leverage. If I throw you and you go far enough, you have to pick bear. <laughs> <laughs> don't let go. Don't let go. Don't I'm not let letting go. It's, it's oh, makeable. Yeah. You, oh, we got to stop hitting that. Alliances yeah. being formed here. Oh, okay. Alliances between Austin oh, and Ryan. One. Ah. Oh my god, what are you doing? <laughs> I think this is it. Oh. 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 Who's, who's, who's having sex right yeah, now? They're okay, fucking okay. up there. Stop, stop oh, swinging. Yeah. Stop swinging. Okay, okay. Kill okay. the momentum. <laughs> I'm going to try to hang oh. a little lower. But it's it's a very risky. Okay, yeah, I got you. Just I'll use your left hand. Oh! oh! Okay, okay, here we go. Oh my god! Hi guys. Hi. Hold on, I gotta get Ryan some 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 momentum here. Ryan! Oh! Oh! oh no! Austin! Oh my gosh! Come on down. All right, one of you has to let go. Come on down. <laughs> one of you has to let go. Let's fall off. No, bear! No, this is not Let's okay. Let's fall off the rails. It's it's fun. It's fun to let go. This is obstruction. This is obstruction. Yeah. I think there's another random in the game dressed like dude, a crash. This is usually happening in Team Northern <laughs> Lion. Ryan, you need a lot of momentum. Go for it, dude. You the Team play. Northern Lion. Go, Ryan, go. go. That was it. That was it. Here's your helmet. <laughs> this is Here it is. Do it. No. Oh, yes. No. Yes. No. Why did we even let go? You let go. I didn't I do did it. Not. I, I did not. I I mean, I can't do it anyway because the Team thing's not there. Nor the lion actually. Oh, please! Oh, this year, I've tied bear at the very and least. Austin actually okay. made it I further. I'm bear. Yes. Oh no. Austin is actually. Hey, guys, there is you a never know. We way still way have 18 way. minutes left, and then he actually resets okay. for the checkpoint. Uh, over here, this way. I don't believe you at all. At all. Not even. No, no. I, he still resets I mean, I, well, from the right, checkpoint. Right. <laughs> I mean, if, if you can, uh, if you can. All that for nothing. Way, then, oh yeah, no, the checkpoint yeah, has pretty, pretty, renewed. Yeah. That is, is the like, new really, checkpoint. Like, you just go into this little lip here, and you can just grab the conveyor belt. Oh really? Yeah. Oh shit. Like, Maybe you, I should try just, that. Yeah. If you, if you just swing Austin onto just it, you can, needs uh, to grab two more lanterns. Oh my god, my arm did the bug thing. Get out of here, crash test dummy! Oh my god, can you kick him mouth, please? Uh, He's I'm actually just... interfering. He just pulled me off the fucking I'm objective. Gonna try. God, what a peep. If I mm. fall because of this, I will cry. I'm taking a. a well, now the now the objective's broken too. All right. Oh no. Uh, Ryan, I guess I'll take the same. Which way do we need to go next? I actually don't know. There we go. See, I'm on the conveyor. Well, we're supposed to might... go there, but that guy just ruined they it. See bear? Yeah. Oh wait, no, it's coming back. It's coming back. Oh, it's coming back. It's coming back. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, I'm See, trapped You inside. let Dan go first, because he'll never make it. <laughs> <laughs> I was oh. the best dummy on that one. Oh, Hello. hi. Hello. Austin right. almost If you jump on me, it breaks leg. it for everyone. I'm just letting all you know right, right, right now. I won't do it. I won't do it. I'm still serving a penalty right now. This is really hard. Second lip. It is tough. He's got oh, it. Oh, he got to the second lip. Oh, okay, here we Austin go. Austin might actually do this. He might actually have a choice. And that would be an easiest oh, choice oh, for Austin. Right. If Austin right. do win, yeah, he so will go under the lip have no choice but oh, to put, to oh, to put oh, Bear Taffy oh, on the block. The Bear and Taffy who actually led the Team Northern Lion to win the first segment today. Oh, I'm dead again. Look at this Ooh, nonsense, man. Oh, uh, man. Oh, both what lanterns. What the fuck? How did they fall? <laughs> lanterns. Oh. <laughs> Ooh. It was too fast. I got it, dude. Yo. Oh, you almost had <laughs> it. Austin, no. <laughs> he's, he's Make it up to the third lantern. Oh, my God. It's so fast. They form an orderly queue, gents. Yeah, they are. Yeah, yeah. God damn it, Mal. <laughs> All you gotta I'm do next. is just land on you got this, it's Robert. Finish you, got play. you don't gotta play got nice, it. boys. Rob's done it. The oh, impossible. Okay. And I got nothing to lose. All right. Anybody else? Want All to you grab gotta on? do is just <laughs> land on that platform. He has oh, done it. Oh, Austin yeah, has done it, ladies and gentlemen. Austin, the dumb dog, has achieved the victory here. That makes everything easier for everybody here. Let's join in. Mm-hmm.
Oh, hello, <laughs> hello, hello. Congratulations to Dom Dog, aka Austin, winning this segment. Thank you, thank you. Whew, well, what, what's your thoughts? Was it was it I, tough? Was it close? It was tough because I I had we had played this map before, but I realized now that Josh literally did all of it anyway. So I didn't know any of the map. That was uh, really close from our perspective. It was really close. It, it, it was. Bear, Bear, me Tappy. and Bear both hit the... Yeah, I thought the Bear Tappy wing. had the win. And I we liked a little bit where you formed a little alliance with Ryan here. <laughs> but it was a, I, I thought I was running out of time. We we still do have 50 minutes, but, but you finished the first. So you get to pick... Who will be get? Who will be put on the block? And the, actually, the only option here is Bear Taffy. You know, Austin could put himself on the block. That's right? true. I could. That's true. Austin, you could put yourself on the block. That'd as be well. a wild move. It it would, but would it be a good move? Yes. <laughs> because I've, if I pulled it off, if I put myself on the block and I didn't get voted out, you that'd win. Be, it'll be an age old thing to be remembered. That's a memory yeah. for life. That's a memory for life. Uh, good thing I already have enough of those, so I will dominate. <laughs> <laughs> well, so the two people who will be on the block tonight is a pocket patrol, aka Robert, and Bear Taffy, aka Bear. <laughs> <laughs> That's what they call me. He's right. Aka Bear. So I mean, we we still do have. Uh, 15 minutes until we have to vote. So if you guys, one want of you to... has to get the course finished here. So, Kaden, right who's who's eligible to vote? Uh, people out. So everyone is eligible to vote except the HOH in this case, which is Ryan. Okay, AKA so me, Team ML, Northern Lion. Me and Austin vote. Yeah, uh, and Bear well, and Rob. Everyone, yeah. everyone but Ryan. Yeah, and me. Uh, yeah, and me, Dan. <laughs> so does, does Bear and Rob? They don't vote because they're on the block, or they do. They vote? do. They do. They but... do vote. I mean, yeah. We know who they're gonna vote for. But, I mean, yeah. you could vote yourself. So, Kate, out. so, so theoretically, <laughs> just me and Austin vote. Kate, is that true? And me. I mean, and I never Malf? really considered the fact that Malf will be voting because he is technically out. Yeah. Is it, why would Malf vote? Why not? I, well, how about Malf is the tiebreaker then? If we, if if the vote is a tie, then Malf gets to choose. That's a great well, idea. I'm down either. with that. Oh, well, like yeah. the HOH decide. So typically, oh, when yeah. someone gets sent to the jury, they're like not in it at all because they lost. Okay. So, you know, Dan does so then, have a point. So I mean, officially, I did say it will be HOH who will be the breaking the tiebreaker here. So. So it'd be Ryan then. It will be all Ryan. All right, let's do it. Okay. Well, I mean, that's, if we do, that's we if do there's a tie. Have Fifteen minutes. So. If so we can deliberate. To, yeah, if yeah you can have to Austin, talk about since we're the only stuff. two voting, can you can me and Austin are we allowed to go talk in a room? Yeah, go ahead. Okay. Austin, would you like you don't would have to, okay would you like if, to? Would it be okay if I listen to it though? Yeah, yeah, of course, of course. Yeah, yeah. All right, all right. All right. We'll get to it. We'll go. We'll go. Would it be right. okay if I was in the room too? <laughs> <laughs> hey, wait, wait, wait. wait. We're done talking. Kate, Kate, since I'm the jury, do I get no, to listen? I, no, 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 no. I, no this Malf is, is a I think that's fair. Malph is eliminated. I, yeah, but I, won't, I won't. I won't talk to you if Malph's in there. He doesn't need to hear. Well, this I don't. I want to. I want to hear from Kate because I'm in the jury now. Don't no, I not fine. get? That's fine. I just won't have the conversation then because stuff I say would affect you, so I don't want you to hear it. Okay. Well, I want Kate mm -hmm. to make a ruling if I'm allowed to listen. That's fine. I mean. I mean, for if you're following the Big Brother's rule, jury, they do get to see what's happening. So then I want, I want in. Okay, cool. And also, it's all good. Just vote how you want to. <laughs> all right. All right. Well, that was that was a little little move there from Daniel. No, that was a, that was a mouth move. Mm. Mm. I'm on the lantern. No did it the mind games daniel already playing the mind games here i mean this is the time they they still do have 11 minutes to play the mind game i want to i want to mm. talk with someone privately that seems fun you want to talk with me sure you want to talk <laughs> <laughs> yeah i'll talk, yeah, okay, can you go talk. Yeah, let's go talk sure put us in the room have a chat. all right oh shit okay Let's let's go listen. Oh shit. 
Hello, Robert. Hello. Hello. Hey. All right. Here's the thing. I'm in the jury. You're in the jury. I need to. I need to make you happy. Yeah. Yeah. So so what what do do you desire something or? Hmm. <laughs> Because I mean, the the obvious vote is bear, right? Like that's the that's the obvious vote. But who says I'm gonna do the obvious vote? You know? Well, I mean, it comes down to like, who do I want to win the most, and why? Do the the I real want question to... is, who do you want to commentate well, with? Next I'll tell. Here's here's what I'll <laughs> tell you. I'll tell you number one. My main objective: Yeet Dan first pops possible <laughs> okay if so you that... can help me do that you're <laughs> you're long term okay hey, that's 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 worth its weight in gold so you're I'll saying you this that. week doesn't matter as much but ne I care... next week you want me to get Dan. yeah like if because i'll remember i will remember that if uh you know depending how next week goes because we know you're okay, gonna be there okay. so if uh if you can get it going then long term, if you make it top two, uh, that's gonna that's if I feel like you've actually contributed to Dan's demise, you're just instant gonna get my get my vote. Okay, okay. This is you know this is a good talk. We le I learned a lot here. Yeah. Dan, you know Dan, uh, you know if Dan wants to talk to me too, that's fine. But uh, Ooh, I, uh, Ryan, I, mean, I think I know Dan what he's gonna Bear say. Dan and Bear actually moving into the, the room. Let's listen so. to this. What oh. uh you know, what do you think in long term if I if I can throw a vote your way? I can win. So I think you can win. I think you're dangerous because you're very good and you're very affable, you know? Austin's win here did not surprise me because he's he's a competitor. But uh and you're right. I am affable. That's a great word for me, Dan. No, you I mean like you're having fun with it, but you're also like, you know, being cordial, mm -hmm. you know? I mean, I didn't um, want to let you fall off the edge right there. We got to go through as a team. Yeah, yeah. Um, so, I mean, because it would be a pretty big move for me to, like, to vote out Rob. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, I think everyone's expecting the split vote. I'm not saying I wouldn't do it, but, like, I would need some kind of, like, assurance. Because next next week, I'm, you know, it's open season, and I fully expect to be exposed in multiple ways. Okay. So, let, so if, let me just, if I kept you... I what? could I could pretty safely assure you that you would be safe from my wrath next week. Okay, so that would include if you win overall, then you wouldn't nominate me. I wouldn't and, nominate you, no. And if I was up, you wouldn't vote me out. Correct. Okay. What's like? All right, I gotta Hello? stop talking. <laughs> What's wrong, Dan? You're sneaky Malfi. Sorry, I'm uh, I'm part of the jury. It's my right. I, Dan voted me out. I think the least he could do is let me listen to his uh, <laughs> his words. No, I, I applaud you for attempting at least. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> <That's awesome. laughs> well, oh, hello. oh, hello, Dan. What did you want to say? You can say it to me. Robert, you slide <laughs> into the other room when you can. Oh well, right. well, well. I'll let I'll let them. Yeah. Oh, and trying to you know sometimes social you engineer Dan. mouth. I almost want to go hear what he has to say. You know. Mouth and Austin forming an alliance saying you gotta vote Dan out next week, then I vote for you, Austin. And and Daniel forming actually alliance with Bear Taffy saying you gotta keep I will I'll keep you in Bear if you if you keep me in. All right, let's let's listen to Alpaca Patrol and Dan Giesling here. Yeah. All right, all right. Now, I'm a weaker player than uh let's, than we, Austin. We is. need to get hold on, let me get Austin in here. The, I, I don't I, for some reason I thought Bloodlines, you know, he'd stick with him. Hold on one sec. It could happen. All right. Austin. Hey. All right. So I was making an assumption. Wait, but were, wait, is Rob yeah. supposed to be in this? Yeah, in yeah. This? Rob's, supposed, Rob's supposed to be in here. Because okay. he, he, I guess I was assumed, and I I don't want, you know what, Rob, can you back, back out for a second? I don't want to put Austin in an awkward position. Sure, yeah. sure. <laughs> yeah. Give me give me, give me, me a second. Hold on. All right. So all right. I, I was under the assumption. I'm just like, well, you know, I'm not going to vote Rob out, and Austin's not going to vote bear out but i guess i'm assuming that Wait, why I mean, do you think i'm not gonna vote bear how do you how do you know who my vote is? i don't i don't i wasn't thinking that far ahead Rob, rob's like well why do you think austin wouldn't get rid of bear now he has a chance i'm like let me talk to austin i don't know what he's gonna do 
Well, it's, it's all a matter of what we want, right? And I, mm-hmm. I don't know what you want, and you don't know what I want. And that's kind of where the dilemma is. Yeah, I mean, for me, like, I know that next week it's open season on me. And, like, you know what I mean? So I got to just, I'm, I have, I'm just trying to survive next week. That's all. Okay, okay. I understand that. So, like, if um, you can give me any assurances, then, I mean, we can, pretty much, we can do whatever the heck we want right now. It's it's tough because, you know, <laughs> I I feel like, like, like Rob said, the easy choice is bear. Mm-hmm. But I, I don't know if uh, if that, that would be the right choice, you know, because it's not about what's the easy choice. It's what the right choice is. What do you think the right choice is? Well, I mean, you got to look at the competition, right? So for you, like clearly you and you and bear are the most skilled with Ryan close third. So, you know, I don't know. But the thing is, I thought maybe you and bear would have made some kind of deal to like make, Hey, let's make it up the final two, the best two that are, you know, the best game players. Uh, it's it's tough to make that kind of deal when when you don't know what games are coming. You know, like I I was, I I I did did worse than Ryan today. Yeah, so. yeah, it's interesting. I I guess I don't know why. I just assumed there we'd vote on um, team lines, but I think that's pretty much thrown out the window. Yeah. But for for viewer, if you're like, hey Dan, this is the ideal situation. What would you want to happen? Uh, for me. Yeah. I want. Let me let me think here. I want you to vote for who you think is the biggest threat to you next week. Not just game wise, but but you know socially as well. Yeah, because you know I Rob's a bit more on the social game than Bear is. I'll be real. Mm. I think Bear's a better game player, but I think Rob can can turn the tables a bit outside of the game. I mean, he he plays Secret Hitler a bunch and and all that, and he he did well in those games. Yeah, I mean, if, but the thing is if. If we're gonna control this thing, now is the time. Next week's not the time, you know. Well, next week it's yeah, it gets crazy. Right. So I don't know. I mean, it's like one of two things: either we kind of do a little side z, side z, and then just go at it and like make make people think we're not gonna vote the same way. But for me to vote to keep, I don't know, or I don't know what we're gonna do. It's it's it, there's a couple scenarios. One, we bear stays. Which is feasible. Or two, he goes. I think if he goes, you have an easier path to get to the end. True. If he doesn't, but, yeah. Yeah. Keeping him here is better for you. Keeping Bear here? Yeah, because then I, I don't have a, a better chance, right? I won't sweep all the, the head of household games with Bear out of the way. Yeah. So I think you want Bear to stay. So maybe we can cut a deal. Maybe I'll 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 let Bear stay. But but you know we gotta we gotta work together here. Or we split the vote and let Ryan pick, and then <laughs> then all of a sudden someone's mad at him because he's got to be the bad guy. Oh, uh, you know what? I like that. <laughs> but then you and I have to be on the exact same page. Like if we get hinky with a vote, then true. it doesn't happen. You know, that's very true. But you know, like because right now me and you are the bad guys if we send someone home. Yeah, you know I mean, because it's not like you can't hide the vote. But if we split right. the vote, we split the vote, yeah, then Ryan has to make the choice. Okay, okay. Well, then, let's just, what do you think? Who do you think Ryan would vote out? I think Ryan would would. I have no clue, actually. I have no clue That's what, what he I would mean. Do. Like he'd have to be pretty savage to vote vote out his his ex teammate. But I mean, I don't think Bear would. Let's vote let's for him make to win. him do it. Let's make him do. It. I agree with this. I'll I'll vote for Rob. You vote for Bear. Or wait. You vote to Vic Rob and I vote to Vic Bear. Uh, or the other way around. It doesn't matter. Here, I'll I'll, I'll do Bear. You do Rob. That yeah. way, that but that no, way it you, feels no, more you, realistic. No, that that you, that you you protect your guys. So you so you'd vote out Rob and I vote out Bear, right? Is that well, no, because it's not about guys anymore, right? Like if I don't like, I would vote Bear. That's that's the way it would work. Okay. So like, I would. Vote, I'll vote Bear. bear. You okay. vote Rob. Okay. Okay. All right. Let's do it. I gotta. When is it? When is it? Hey, Ryan Gary. Can I Hello, talk Daniel. To you for a second? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Have you played out all the scenarios in your head? Um, I I think I've I've come to a decision. I've examined some of the, you know, some of the parameters that are on display here. So clearly, I mean, I don't know how much you're worried about next week. I'm extremely yeah. concerned because I think it's open season. Why wouldn't you take so, a shot? 
Yeah, of course. I would be worried too, based on your performances in the games <laughs> up to this point. <laughs> but I mean, have you thought about your ideal situation right now? Um, yeah, I would say that it, it's crossed the, my mind for sure. Is there have anything you thought about can... your ideal situation? I mean, my ideal situation. <laughs> here's what I think. I think. Okay. I think if Bear goes home. I think either way, I'm in trouble. It doesn't to me. It doesn't matter who stays. I'm in trouble. I'm next gone. So I'm just looking at, to cut a one week deal, and I really haven't solidified anything. Right. I mean, my ideal situation would be if you and uh, Rob stayed in the game because we're well. Bad. <laughs> I didn't I mean, say that. I know, but that you won't offend me. It's just I, no. It's it's if uh, everybody votes uh unanimously so i don't have to make a decision and make any enemies hmm. but you don't have a preference who you'd want to send home then i have a preference is just something i'm not necessarily comfortable no, uh no. airing it out in front of a live audience i understand yeah, no exactly but who, who are you, you gonna vote for that's what I, i'm trying like i just assumed going in this we'd vote team lions and then i'm starting to understand that may not be the case hmm which is news to me. I don't from, know why I just from your that conversations way. with other people. Yeah. Okay. I see what you're saying. <laughs> so, but I that, like I don't know. Why. I just didn't, you know, that didn't cross my mind. Well, in that case, I think you should vote with your heart. <laughs> Damn. Ryan's not giving right. in. Right. Ryan's not giving in. So you in. have no idea. You just the only thing you don't want is for it to be a split, and you got to decide. Ideally, yeah. I'm just happy to be here. Yeah, me too. All right, Ryan. Well, good luck. Uh, Pleasure doing business with you. Yeah, yeah. I'll talk to you soon. Well, oh, oh, no, 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 no. Leave case to Ryan. Oh, do Ryan, I need to go I do think that? He knows. He knows Yo, Rob, what's going to happen. In the, in the, uh, <laughs> real quick. Sure, sure. We're we're gonna gonna talk, talk, we got to go talk to Ryan, time, I guess. How much time we got? Hello. Bro. Yes, sir. Things are, things are getting a little spicy, man. Are well, they? Like, uh, yeah, like, I just assumed we'd vote on team lines. And I'm starting to, I mean, you you kind of sparked that conversation. Like, yo, Daniel, why would you think that? Yeah. I mean, I I, I would be surprised if uh, if it went that way, honestly. Ladies and gentlemen, um, right now, but, there are three You know, again, happening. it's out of my hands, Austin, so I don't know. Austin, Mouth talking. Yeah. happy, speaking, Northern Lion talking. I'm, Robert and Dan Gilling talking. Out of the two players We've on the block, jump in the room to see what's so happening right now. If you want to get to the first place spot, it's better better odds getting out the more threatening. Uh, to some extent, at least. How could I, in good conscience, betray our team after you got us an extremely comfortable win this week. I certainly appreciate that perspective. I, I wouldn't be able to to live with myself. Well, I right and I, I, I ask for nothing in return, except for, you know, it, if the situation comes to pass in the future, just remember the loyalty that I've presented right here, that it asks for nothing in return. I think that's all that needs to be said. Maybe. I don't... <laughs> yeah, I won't put you up next week. Sure. And and if I'm on the block, you will not vote me out. Yeah, sure. Yeah, I I, I I will I will take that. Yeah, absolutely. I feel like at this point we just need to kind of. It's really just we're on week two of our original deal, and like I, I'm mixing it up a little bit, but you know, to me at this point, like I feel like I'm target number one. Like just honestly, like next mm -hmm. week when it's open season, so I, and I feel like you're probably the only person that wouldn't put me up. Or vote me out. Yeah, I mean, I, I won't. I won't put you up. Uh, I, I'll. I'll. Uh, yeah, I'll get for sure. Yeah, I. I, I don't have any. Uh, I don't have any reason to next week for sure. At that right. point. So here's. I'm gonna tell you what's gonna. I can't tell you what's gonna happen. All I can tell you is it's either gonna be your safe two zero or it's gonna be a one one split, and Ryan's gonna decide. But I will. I promise you, I will not vote you out. All right. Hell yeah. Well, uh, I won't vote you out next week. I promise you that. Or, or you won't. If you win, you won't nominate me either, right? Yeah, 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 okay, okay. But yeah, <laughs> yeah, for sure. All right, Robert, you know, like, to, uh... players, please return to the general section. The voting will start in any second now. Players, please return to the general section of the voice com. The voting will start any second now. No, but I also understand <laughs> you may have like uh, Sorry to introduce, a pre-existing uh, pre relationship with Austin, which I understand. Yeah. But the yeah. voting will start in any minute. 
So please return to the general section of the voice channel, please. Okay. Okay. Party one either way. All right. All right. Welcome. Welcome, everybody. Hello. Hello. We will come Hello. in. We will commence the voting for the week two, season one of Champions of Salt. We have, we know how it goes. I'll be at the jury room and I'll drag per one person at a time. Please mute yourself, mute yourself from the, the stream, everything. And please say who you are voting out. And at the same time, please DM me the name of the person that you're voting out. Good what do I do, Kate? Hmm? What do I do? Just sit here? Uh, yeah, I guess you, you can enjoy, enjoy the freedom. <laughs> <laughs> uh, good luck, everybody. I'll, I'll see you on the other side. All right. First off, we're going to have Robert. Hello. You yeah, have muted the Discord instead. All right, please say the name that you would like to evict from the Champion Assault and also DM me the name as well. Thank you very much. Next off, I will invite Bear, Bear Taffy. Hello. <laughs> All right, please. All right, please also DM me the name as well. Thank you. Next off, we're going to invite Austin. Now he did form alliance with Dan Giesling here. We'll see if he, if, if he will follow the alliance with Dan Giesling. He might not, we'll see. Welcome. Hello, Austin. Please say the name that you would like to evict. And also DM me the name. Thank you very much. Now, next off, it's going to be Dan Giesling. It will be very interesting to see if he will follow what he has promised. He has promised many different things to many different people. Hello, Daniel. Uh, please make sure that you have muted yourself from the stream. And please tell me the name that you would like to evict. I can hear you. Uh, tell me and also DM me, please. All right, thank you very much. All right. So, we'll take the three minute break here. And after three minute break, I will announce the vote result. Hello, hello, hello. We'll take a quick three minute break. And after the break, I will tell you the result. All right, I'll, I'll see you guys in three minutes. All right. All right. All right. How's everyone feeling right now? Second person about to walk out the door. Mm. It's, uh, it's, I don't know. I don't know how things are shaping up. We'll see. So I guess, and, and so if there's a tie, it's going to go to Ryan, right? That's true. That's, that's how the game works. Oh, man. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I don't know about you. I, I wouldn't want to split a 1-1 one, one tie and be the sole reason why someone's going to go home. <laughs> that's, that's just me. Because, I mean, at that point, you're basically, like, you know, cutting someone's throat. Yeah, but <laughs> Ryan doesn't have a choice, you know? 
I'm Just cutting someone's right throat so that everybody <laughs> else can eat, though. <laughs> 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 Looks like meat's back on the menu, boys. <laughs> Wee. Man flesh. Dun, 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 dun. That is a Lord of the Rings. He's right. Mm. He's right. What about their legs? They don't they need nose. No, Oliphants, Mr. Frodo, they'll never believe we saw these back in the Shire. <laughs> <laughs> Irish, Irish evolution. Sam. I thought we were doing Lord of the Rings. That's Samuel, not Sam. <laughs> I'm Samwise Gamgee, I tell you. I didn't eat the bread. <laughs> Lambus bread, elf bread. <laughs> Oh, that's a fine elven rope you got there. <laughs> Who can do the best uh, <laughs> golem? Uh, I bet Sam. Stupid fat hobbits. Oh, okay. bear. The answer is bear. bear. I'm Don't glad he went first so that yeah. no one else has to do it. Yeah. <laughs> can you do the, the wriggling? You do that part? Wriggling. Now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good, yeah. I like that. To I want that to be my uh... so juicy sweet. <laughs> this music's intense. Like it's like sad and happy and and <laughs> mysterious, and it's like yeah. it's like the vote's about to be revealed. The perfect <laughs> backdrop, man. <laughs> you know what would be like horrible is like Tetris music. That'd be way like not fitting yeah. at all. Thank oh, yeah. God that's not a part of things. Yeah. Yeah. I stopped. Like, uh, I stopped when I was told to stop. <laughs> but you were playing Tetris ninety nine. I was waiting in my head of household room for people to come in and uh, plead their case, and a couple of people did it. Mm, I don't remember uh, getting a check in the mail from Nintendo mm -hmm. on, uh, <laughs> on this uh, event. You guys want to harmonize? Sure. E uh... No, it doesn't. Never works. It just <laughs> yeah, it no, never works. After has, like four people are talking at once, Discord is just like. <laughs> it's just a three point. A e -e 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 -e. That's all you gotta do. I know, but it's Discord, man. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on, wait. I, I, I got you. Give me a second. Uh, here, I'll do the, I'll do the, I'll do the three. Someone else do the five, okay? No, you can't talk to us that way. Oh. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, no, you got okay. You fucking. <laughs> Oh, oh, he's just got his own thing. Okay. Oh, hello. Oh, oh hi. Hello. Uh, hello, oh, hello. The vote result is here with me. Mm -hmm. And the result is a tie. So, in this case, we actually have to ask the HOH here, Northern Lion, please join me to the jury room for one second. Mm, okay, I will. Now, please mute yourself from the stream. How so? Well, That is true. All right, please cast your vote when you do. Please also DM me, I can hear you. Also DM me the name as well. Who would you like to vote out? All right, thank you very much. You may return to the general call. Hello. Now I have the result here. And the person who is going back home tonight is Robert Alpaca Patrol. You're going home tonight. Sorry, but we, you you did your best. Uh, any any last word for to the boys before you leave?
It's Robert. I, I wish I had warned you, but... Shoot, shooting yourselves in the foot. Well, uh, now, <laughs> honestly, uh, Bear, take it all the way, buddy. Hey, thanks, man. Appreciate yeah. it. Oops. I, it was muted on my end, but that's okay. They, they yeah, can it. I can I go home too? Like, <laughs> Rob, Ryan's not, or Rob's not the only one that gets to go home, right? <laughs> I mean, technically, you're you're at home right now, but <laughs> yeah, thank you. And then uh, instead of actually interviewing Robert, we're doing something different. I'll be interviewing the team captains because oh. next week the immunity will be gone. So mm. I'd like to hear uh, the thoughts for the both of the team. I will move them to the interview room. Oh, hello. 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 Uh, are you Ms. surprised Luteno? with the result tonight? Not really, because uh, <laughs> I didn't. I, I, I got to say, I, I'm a little surprised. I thought maybe mm. Ryan would have wanted a little more easy street, but apparently what what that tells me is that, you know, the team lines are a little bit thicker than you know, we thought. You know, I have to pay it forward. I drafted Bear Taffy first overall. I didn't draft him you know, just to yeet him out of the house for one. Moreover, he won us the games, especially this week. So I'm paying a little gratitude towards him. I'm hoping it, it might come back to help me in the end too. I, res I respect it. What do you make of El Paca Patrol's parting words? Um, rooting for Bear Taffy to take this thing to the end. I think it's justifiable to, to be mad at the person who... Uh, voted for him i just hope that he also remembers that the only reason i was able to vote for him is because somebody else voted for him in the first place mm. two people voted to eliminate rob it wasn't my vote it was two votes that led to him being yeeted that could be a good selling point if you find yourself in the final two and you need to get rob's vote who'd you vote for dan um uh, am I allowed to reveal this information or is it <laughs> to remain private? I'm asking the host. I mean, right. you're supposed to keep it private, but tomorrow, I mean, next week, it's it's free for all. So if you think this will play as in your advantage. Yeah, I guess we'll just see where the chips may fall. But I, but I will say, you know, I've been in this situation before. I see the writing on the wall. Um, I, I think it's going to be a tough week up, upcoming, but I'm looking forward to the challenge. How about you, Ryan? Are you ready for the challenge next week? The immunity will be gone now, so you do really have to pull up your weight. You know, it's it's scary uh, because I'm not going to be able to be carried by having superior gamers on my team anymore. But at the same time, it's uh, it's nice to to have the training wheels off, and you know, you you get to rise or fall based on your own merit for the first time. Well, thank you very much, uh, Ryan and Dan. It was a pleasure to have you tonight. And good luck to you both next week. Thanks, thank Mr. you. Letourneau. All right. Well, that actually concludes the week two of Champion Salt Season 1, brought to you by Good Shepherd Entertainment. I am Kate Lovely Momo. Thank you for watching and also have a good night.